Hello, chat. Oh, wait. <laughs> I forgot to start the timer. There we go. Hello, chat. Hope everyone's having a wonderful Tuesday. I know. Tuesday, Griffin stream? Crazy. <laughs> the, the, the timer is still going, so we must continue. Hello, hello, chat. Welcome in, welcome in. Let me hide this for now. Let me hide that. There we go. That's better. It's too cramped in here. <laughs> Welcome in everyone! Hope you're having a great day! I used to work in a shoe recycling shop. It was soul destroying. Okay, Sari Bot, thank you for the thank you for the joke. Let's see, welcome in Jake. Congrats on first today. Oh heck, that was earlier than I expected. Yeah, I'm a little earlier than, than I expected too. I was expecting to be here at like 1, uh, maybe even 2 o'clock, like around normal Friday stream, but I was sitting here for like half an hour. I was like, man, I don't have anything going on right now. Let me just... Let me just, uh... Yeah, I guess start stream early. Welcome in, Frangula! Good to see you! Welcome in, Hug! Welcome in, Howling! Welcome in, Zafiro! Uh, let's see, let's see. Jake, thank you so much for the 70s stream watch. You're getting up there, holy heck. Uh, welcome in, Electric. Early stream today? Yeah, long stream today, too. My my turn to not be ready. I just gotta sign a big task due for tomorrow. Oh, no! I hope we can get it done, hug. Welcome in, Tranquil. Welcome in, Ollie. Oh, God, oh, God. I really need to clean my mouse wheel. Oh, no. Uh, let's see, let's see. My chat just starts scrolling real fast. Let's see. Never eaten Omar rice? I've never eaten Omar rice either. I really want to try it. Let's see, let's see. I'm catching up, I'm catching up. Yeah, I hope you get a chat someday soon. I think it's simple like fried rice with an undercooked omelet on top. Yeah, I think it is. And sometimes they put ketchup on it too. Oh, welcome in Tariffs. Good to see you. All good, all good. Thank you for the lurk. Welcome in Eddie. It's the fox, it is the fox. Streamer's here. Oh, since we're starting, might as well do shoutouts. Heck yeah. <laughs> Welcome in, Dark. Good to see you. Also, Electric, thank you so much for continuing your gift sub from Howling. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Uh, Loki, after such a long day, Griffith Stream's the perfect thing to raise my mood. Heck yeah. Let's go. <gasps> Electric, thank you so much for the five gift subs. I'm trying to catch up. Uh, let's see, let's see. Welcome in, Dark Shadow. Hello, hello. Uh, hi, Griffin by Griffin at work. Thank you so much for the, the lurk dark. I hope work goes well. Yes, that electric. Thank you so much for the five gift subs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Raise the timer. Heck yeah. <laughs> Raise the timer. Raise the timer. Keep keep streaming here forever. <laughs> Welcome in, Scotty. Hello, hello. We're having a great day. Also, uh, Eddie and Hug, thank you both so much for opening up the YouTube. I appreciate it. Got me some... Nice hot tea with honey today, so hopefully I don't lose my voice. Raise the timer, hit the call. Oh no! Hug! Thank you so much for the 10 gift subs. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness, I wasn't expecting it already. Thank you, thank you. Let me double check that my bot's working. Okay, it is good. Alright, thank you so much! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Oh, the timer has been raised. <laughs> um... Oh. Had me some breakfast, woke up kinda early. Got dishes done, did some things I needed to get done. Hung out with my dogs, it was a good morning. Now we're ready to play some Spyro, but first, uh, again, here are all of the goals for today, for the festival. Uh, my balance is wrong, I just noticed that. That is odd. Let me fix that, chat. Takes a bacon and I'll put it in a pancake. That's what's gonna make bacon pancakes. Been a while. Uh, again, life keeps changing, but I come when I can. Hope you're doing well. Oh, thank you so much, Dark Shadow. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Gonna make bacon pancakes. Bacon pancakes. Make bacon pancakes. Take some bacon and I'll put it in a pancake. Do 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 do. Bacon pancake. <laughs> bacon pancakes. That's what's gonna make bacon pancake. <laughs> 
We are with Lucha. Heck yeah. Uh, let me fix this really quick. Let's see. Need to fix my time. Do do do. Beer beef food time. Oh, I hope we have a good dinner for you a lot. If only there was a Griffin Wiggle emote. One day. One day. I need money to get it rigged. Added music makes the pancakes sound better. It really does. It really does. Let's see. So this needs to go here. What? So we should be... Right here then. Oh, Jake! Oh, I'm already losing my voice. Oh, no. <laughs> we have the tail. Look what we do. We can use that one at least true. Jake, thank you so much for the gifts of the Frank one. I think that worked. I think that worked, yeah. I think it added it. There we go. I, that, that count should be correct. Uh, we're 11 away from the first goal now. Also, look at Pixie Foxy! Hello, hello! Fall Fox Festival, because fall is greater than all seasons. We're celebrating the fall of Gwenox, heck yeah. <gasps> Packs of kittens! Thank you so much for the, the the throne contribution. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Hello, welcome in. Oh my goodness. Let me write this down. Thank you so much. I hope you're having a good day. Oh, thank you so much, Hug. Yes, this is... We are celebrating the Fall Equinox, hosting a Festival Subathon, and they here are all my goals, which is also in that tweet. Uh, you can contribute to the timer by subbing, uh, gifting subs, or throne gifting and donating, and you can find the links on my page or with exclamation point tip. And I know there was a Fall Equinox, I just thought it's up to fall. Yeah, on Sunday! On Sunday, the 22nd! It was the Fall Equinox. Let's see, let's see. Alright, let me do that. And then I gotta add you to the count. Because my bot does not check for throwing stuff. So we should be at... Oh, my brain's dying. My brain's dying. Oh, thank you, Zafaro. Thank you so much. Also, yes, if anyone wants to follow my Twitter, join my Discord, check out my YouTube, Twitch, my Throw, and there are all my links in chat. Welcome in, Turtle! Hello, hello! Let's see. Let's I know I just got here, but gotta sleep. Have a good stream. All right, kittens. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Oh my goodness, Jake. I just fixed the timer. Oh, that doesn't seem right. Oh, that doesn't seem right. Oh no, what did I do? What did I do? What did I do? That, that's, the timer's not correct. Oops. <laughs> Already not mathing. You guys, you, you guys have me, have me. Blah, 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 blah. Please have a good sleep, kittens. Thank you so much again. Also, Jake, thank you so much for the uh, <laughs> finishing off the waffle maker. Now, now I can make you a waffle. Heck yeah! Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Gotta open up my phone. Gotta go put a new a new gift. We use the power of math against her. You are actively. Hello, Aqua. Welcome in. Welcome in. Good to see you. Hope you're having a great day. Yeah, I need to fix it now. I need to fix it. You guys have me have me all all goofed up. Let's see, let's see. Do 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 let's put a new throne gift. Uh I guess I'll pin this one. Get me a new a new uh tea pitcher. I only know about the Harvest Moon, like the game was on the 17th. Oh really? I've actually never played Harvest Moon. It seems like a really comfy game, though. Alright, so let's see. Do, 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 do. Oh, 
brain is dying. Da, 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 da. Yeah, brain is dying. Brain is dying. Oh, what do we do when the brain dies? How do I restart the brain? Alright, so it was at... Okay. There we go. I think that's the first goal reached. I think it is. So... You turn it off and on again? How do, how do I... How do I turn it off and on again? Stardew Valley was inspired by Harvest Moon. Oh, that's really cool. It's a very pretty thing to see in the sky. Oh, the Harvest Moon? Oh. I don't know if I've ever seen the Harvest Moon. Yes, I think we are at the first goal, so... There we go. I, I'm just gonna say that's the timer now. I... I might have overestimated it a bit. I'm not entirely sure, but there we go. <laughs> Welcome in, Henrik. Good to see you. I don't know. I like the emotes. They take a lot of getting used to, especially when I'm used to my uh, own emotes from Twitch. It, it takes getting used to to the the YouTube emotes. Is that eleven hours now? I think so. Yeah, I think so. Because we were at 10, and then a lot of people gifted subs, and then uh, Kittens and Jake donated. So I think so. I think we're at 11 hours now. Gonna chat here is always to help. Thank you so much, Henrik. I appreciate it. Once you get super chats and stuff, you'll have emotes. Yeah, true, true, true. We're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, I have a friend with a mole in the back of his neck. No, struck me saying that was the on-off button. Oh my god, I would too. I would too, honestly. Do you know about the problems with bits right now? Uh, as far as I know, that got resolved. As far as I know, that got resolved. But yes, I have been hearing about that. Been hearing a lot of people have been getting banned for... Uh, uh, I forget. Uh, purchasing purchasing uh, illegal bits or something like that. When sometimes they haven't even ever bought bits before or haven't in so long. Something like that. And it's, it's silly. It's silly. Speaking of bits, Twitch owes me like a hundred, a hundred bits, like a dollar. They're not very good with, uh, with, uh, giving that kind of stuff. <laughs> okay, yeah, 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 I've been seeing, I've been saying it on, on Twitter. I know the CEO got wind of some tweets that were like, keeping track of everything about that. And said he'd look into it, and then Twitch made a post about how they... Uh, we're looking into it, and they reversed all of the the ones that happened and everything. So everything should be good with that now. That was really weird, though, that that even happened. I wonder why it happened. I I really wonder why it happened. That's very curious. How it just happened out of nowhere, too. They didn't add 100 bits to your account. That's really weird. Um, did any of that happen to non-VTubers? Uh, I think I did see a few streamers that had, like... Oh... Uh, they had, like, uh, IRL profile pictures, so I didn't go to their streams or anything, but I assumed that they were, they were, uh, webcam streamers. So I think that some of them weren't VTubers. But it did seem like a majority of them were VTubers, which is very odd. It was very odd. Something sussy going on there. Um, but yeah. They hopefully got that resolved, so we shouldn't have to worry about it. But yeah, now I have to say corn for the next hour. That's gonna be fun. I'll start it here in a minute once we get to the game. Unless you'd rather I start it right now, Con. <laughs> you know what? I'll just start it right now, Con. It's okay. We're gonna be we're gonna be chatting for for a while, Con. Oh my god. Let me let me go close my door. My dog's just opened it again, Con.
Wah, I am back, con. Con, 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 con. Con, 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 con. <laughs> um, but yeah, the next, the next goal is to uh, make me cry and watch old clips, con. Con, 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 con. I was expecting you to have a cat instead. I'm not a cat, though. I'm not gonna say nya, I'm gonna say con. Cause fox goes con. Con, con, con. Con? 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 I think it's con. Con? I mean, there's pet. Oh, no, I have two doggos. Con. So yeah, we've watched some clips. Uh, timer gets added to... Okay, okay, Kon. I'm not a cat, Nia, Kon. I think it's Kon too, Kon. Kon, Kon. Uh, you guys will get to pick my second hairstyle, Kon. You'll get to throw things at me, Kon. More timer added. And more strawberry, Kon. Uh, secret goal, Kon. Uh, we will have a hand cam, bacon pancakes cooking stream, Kon. New emotes, Kon. Horror game, con. 24 whole hours added to the timer, con. And then end stream, con, which is mostly a joke, but if we get there, I will end the stream, con. Just alt that for, con. <laughs> uh, Zola, thank you so much for the 95 stream watch stream, con. Balls, con. That's, that's a very enlightening message, con. Also, if you donate 50. Or donate, sub, uh, tip, uh, throne, whatever, $50, con. You get doodle. If you donate, sub, tip, throne, whatever, $100, you get to make me eat more strawberries, con. And then the top donator, we get art together, and the top three donators, you get VIP. And uh, custom Discord role if you're in the Discord and custom audio thank you con. Hello anti you, hello new day, new day. Thank you so much for the seven stream watch straight con. Uh, thank you for the alert con. I hope you have a good day at work con. Thank you, thank you con. All right, let's. Oh, let me set up the game con. Con, 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 con. It's gonna be a long hour, con. <laughs> okay, chat. Are you guys ready for Spyro, con? I'm ready for Spyro, con. Da 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 da. Ba da da ba 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 da ba ba. Da 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 da. Say chat is dumb? No, Kun. Yeah, Spyro Kun. <laughs> Spyro Kun, Spyro Kun. Whatever, Dragon Kun. <laughs> Kun Kun. Need to adjust my volume, Kun. Oh, wait, no. No, I don't. Apparently not, Kun. Kun, 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 Kun. <gasps> oh, Con! <laughs> Hello, Brew! Hope you're having a good day, Con! <gasps> Alright, let me get the game set up, Con! Now that it's working. Alright, chat, let's go, Con! Con, Con. Let's see, how can I adjust your names, chat? You got Hagakon. We got a Brukon. We got Anticon. We got Nukon. <laughs> Landscapers are outside. I can't concentrate on work and I can't hear Griffin. Turn the volume up louder, Con. <laughs> The anti-con, yes, the anti-con. You all are con-con. 
Never got a play Spyro. I had for my PlayStation, but it would crash. Con? Oh. Yeah, turn the landscapers down, Con. I can't concentrate. Oh no, Haga Con. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Alright, let's play some Spyro Con. This is the first one that I ever played, Con. Ho hopefully, you guys enjoy it. I enjoyed it. Let's see if it holds up to uh, uh, however long it's been. Con. Hagakon za uh, za uh, za Zafikon? Zafikon. Zafikon, yes, Zafikon. Hagakon Zafikon. Jikkon. Yes. Moderator kon. <laughs> have you 100 percent of a spiral game before? I don't think I have kon. Zafiro kon time. <laughs> Zafiro tikon. Zephyro <laughs> Alright, alright, let's go to game chat. Let's go to game con. Wow. My need to adjust the volume con, depending on uh, how loud it is con. Which seems very quiet con. Okay, Kun, let's go. Uh, oh! While looking for these games, Kun, I realized there was a whole second game that I never played, Kun. This is apparently a trilogy too, Kun. But I only played the first game and the third game, Kun. In the year of the dragon, in a world beyond the realms. I, like all the others, awaited the birth of the dragon of whom the prophecies foretold. But the Dark Master heard the prophecies as well. Mm. I should have hidden the eggs long before, but I... I thought we were ready. I thought they were safe. Oh no, gone. Oh, how I was wrong. <gasps> <gasps> Oh no, Kun! Don't crack us, Kun! How's the audio, Kun? Seems quiet, Kun. Save them, only one egg, Kun? Yes. Oh no, Con. We can hear the game. Okay. Okay, Con. May the ancestors look after you. May they look after us all. Dragon Moses, Con. <laughs> con, Con. Oh. And then there was nothing gone. See, era presents gone. Yeah, Chrome Studios production gone. A dragon floating down the river gone. The legend of Spyrocon, a new beginning. Starring <gasps> Elijah Wood. Uh, er, chat. Why is that name familiar, Con? Why is that name familiar, Con? Miss Sierra, Sierra used to be my favorite publisher. I don't know what they've done, Con. The egg came to rest in a distant swamp. Elijah Wood was a hobbit. Oh, okay, Con. Around, wondering what magnificent creature could possibly live inside. 
If you tweet something now, you'll have to add the con at the end. Yes, con. Con, con. Con, con, con. So in your game name, Sierra, oh yeah, didn't they make the King's Quest point and click games going? It's going to be Griffin going, yes. First, but finally amazed and astonished them. I don't think we get to name ourselves Nine, though, Gone. Ten. Here I come. It was a purple dragon, who they eventually adopted and raised as one of their own. They named him Spyro, and he grew up alongside Sparks. The young dragonfly who was born the same day. In oh, fact, God. the two were almost like brothers. And a more oddly matched yet compatible pair of brothers the world has never seen. Never catch me this time, purple boy. As for Spyro, he, like all of us, accepted the world into which he was born, believing he was one of them. What a the heck, gone? Purple, one of them, true. But one of them, nonetheless. Sierra was one of the early leaders of the point and click, which is what I grew up on. King's Quest, Space Quest, Police Quest, etc. Con? Oh, that's a lot of quests, Con. <laughs> that's a lot of Con Quest. <laughs> Use the right analog stick to move the camera to find sparks, Con. I see you, my little glowing friend. Seeing and catching are two different things, a big boy. Yeah, you better run. Use the left analog stick to move Spyrocon. Whee! I wonder why it's pausing every few seconds. Very odd, Con. Woo! It's been so long since I last heard someone mention Sierra Con. What's the matter, little Spyro? You can't fly? Oh, that's uh. right. You walk everywhere. Mm, that's too bad. Uh. <laughs> Your toast got us in the cone. Of course, it would be an old person Con. No, press and hold R1 to charge Con. Going to bed now, Griffin. I hope you have a lovely stream. Thank you, Tranquil Corn. Thank you, thank you. I hope you have a wonderful sleep, Corn. Maybe I'll wake up before you end. Okay, Corn. If not, I hope you have a good day tomorrow, Corn. To lose all the time. <laughs> all right, let me out of here, you overgrown fungus. What? Spyro, seriously, let me a hand here, will you, brother? Jeez, Sparks. I don't know. Frogweed's got to eat too. Spyro, oh. whack it! Do something! I'm your buddy! Oh, I'm too My small, Con. Might as well go full, Con. Con, Con. Con, Con. Heck yeah, Con. <laughs> I'm EP and still have six hours of work left, so sip. No sip, Con. No sip, Con. <laughs> Welcome in, Leon. Good to see you, Con. Good to see you, Con. Besides, they were taken over by Vivian D, and everything went down the hill from there, Con. That sucks. Press circle to melee attack, Con. Hello, Zwing! Welcome in, Con. Hope you're having a good day. Attack the frogweed three times. Yeah, 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 Con. Why is she saying Con? Because we reached the first goal, Con. Ugh. Now I smell almost as bad as you do. <laughs> and that's pretty bad. See you later, sucker. So much for gratitude. I've always hated this firefly con. He's my awful. He's almost worse than Paimon con. I'm back. Come back, Frankolan. What did you get to eat con? Oh, I'm going to turn this down con. Wait, are these the spiral games with the combat clone? Yes. Yes, clone it is.
ka naman shane kon so you know i must go to work kon have fun with the stream kon okay zafi kon i hope you have have fun with with the the work kon man shane man shane what kon the socks kon like the fairy from Zelda that always goes, Hey, listen, so many people hate corn, yes. Well, thank you for the hydrate corn. Chicken noodle soup for my brother and mom. They got COVID. Oh no, corn. I hope they feel better soon, corn. Thank you for the hydrate and the head pants, Afi corn. Have a good day at work. Spyro, god of corn. <laughs> you not sucks. What are you gonna munch on then, corn? So that's what you were last talking about, was the socks going? I think. Can't have my socks gone. Okay, let me hydrate gone. Oh, the tail! I see, I see. No, can't, can't munch on that either. Don't want, don't want hair in your mouth gone. That's gross. It's cheating. We're not allowed in there. Yeah, uh, excuses, excuses. Catch up or give up, Chunky. He called us Chunky Con. We're gonna eat that firefly for dinner, Con. Griffin, does your tail grow back? No, Con. It does not grow back. I am a fox, not a lizard, Con. Oh, there we go, Con. Okay. Go this way, Con. Okay, that was kind of funny, Con. Ooh, what's this, Con? Oh, nothing. Okay, Con. Yeah, Con. Yeah. I like the boingy noise that they make, Con. Foul stock sound effect hit sounds? Oh, really? Got us angry, Con. Oh, we got hit, Con. The cones are very cute, no Con. Well, I beat up the monkeys, Con. Definitely stock sounds. Oh, oh, <gasps> dynamite gone. What? What the heck? Since when was I a sub con? Ah, uh, you got gifted a sub earlier, con. I think from from Jake con. Also, the audio seems off con. Whoa, Con. That monkey jumped really far, Con. Oh! Fight me like a thing, whatever you are. You pathetic wretch. <gasps> Congratulations! <gasps> we got fire, Con. Was that fire, dude? Take care of him. I gotta report to sender. Cinder con. How is the audio chat? I mean, let me know. Get the crystals gone. Oh, 
already got one. There he is. Can I just farm crystals here, Colin? Are they gonna keep throwing monkeys at me? Maybe they're just gonna keep throwing monkeys at me, Colin. Can I just farm crystals here forever, Colin? <laughs> Nope, that's all of them gone. We out of here, Spyro. I think my wings are singed. Yeah. You okay? You almost torched me, dude. Wait. You breathe fire. So I'm just about ready to blow the top off that place and kick <gasps> that guy's booty when Spyro let loose with some serious flame, dude. No joke. Flame from the mouth. Well, I, I, I was just trying to help. No, yeah, some help. He nearly turned me to ashes, dude. Mom, Dad, you should have seen him. He came out breathing fire. All right, I tell you, it was crazy. Can you hear it? Okay, you chat. Me. Spyro, tell him. Well, it's true, Dad. I swear. I just got real mad, opened my mouth, and whoosh, Flame City. It's not that, Spyro. I believe you both. It's just that your mother and I knew. Can you hear the dialogue? Okay, go on. What day? The day. When we would have to tell you the truth. Oh Still no, Con, we're adopted, Con. He wasn't a dragonfly after all. <laughs> we're adopted, Con. Unknown distant land. So, you, you mean I, I'm not your real son? You are our real son. It's just that you came from somewhere else, far away, where wars rage on and on, and the innocent seem to always pay the price. It wasn't long after that night that Spyro decided to venture forth and find him. Oh, what a gust we were adopted, Con. Leaving sparks behind the old homestead? Not a care in the world. Don't look back. This is your home, Sparks. But I just found out that my home is out there somewhere. And I've got to find it. Besides, I'm not leaving you behind. I'm just leaving you where you belong. Well, I thought I belonged with you. Because I'm always with you. But I guess I was wrong, huh? I'm Leave sure him be, Con. You know what? You're right, I'm wrong. Don't worry about him, Spyro. You know how hot-headed he can be. You'll see him when you get back. Now, now, son. Keep your head up. Your nose clean, and use that breath of yours wisely. All gifts come with a price. Mm. Don't listen to your father's preaching, Spyro. Just be yourself. It's all any of us can do. Okay, Con. Spyro isn't a dragonfly, he's flying dragon. Inconceivable. So, as it was, Spyro left the only family he had ever known and journeyed <sighs> on to where he did not know. <gasps> oh no, Con! They're coming after me, Con. We're not paying attention, Con! We're gonna get jumped, Con. Back into the cup, con. Whoa, they're do they're they're doing poor quarter up there, con. Oh. Oh my goodness. Okay. That was spooky, Con. Oh, maybe it's... Maybe it's freezing now and then because of the autosave, Con. Oh, crunchy, Con. Okay. Oh! Okay, Con. What is this, Con? Uh, can't hit that, Con. Yeah, yeah! Whoa, what is this, Con? Uh, there's something back here, Con. Maybe it's the firefly? 
or not? No, I was wrong, Kun. Can't hit that either, though, Kun. Oh, big spider, Kun. Er, er, braid, spring shrub, Kun. Very ash, shrub, marrow, Kun. Okay. Press XX to double jump. Hold X after jumping to glide. Spiral. So, uh, me and the old man were chatting, and this whole belonging thing, you know, came up, and we decided that best friends belong together. Even if one of them is purple and does have some weight issues. Weight issues, huh? Well, at least I've never been turned into a lantern. Oh, please, lantern schmantern. Let's see what's out there. Collecting green gems will give you breath energy. Oh, okay. Also, I forgot to change my category. Why these these spiders screams are so weird, Kong. You can horn dive into enemies by pressing X to jump and then R1 gong. Oh no! That wasn't a good idea! Who still said I should do that, Kon? I almost died, Kon. So the red gems are HP, Kon. And the green gems are fire con. Wow. So it doesn't seem like we can get rich con because they're just they fill the bar. So game the fun uh, so funny the games like jump to see if you can survive. Yeah, apparently con. Will you kill them fast enough to live? Oh. Wow! Oh, can't hit that. Thank you for the life, Frangle and Kong! Okay. Yeah! Can head bash him, Kon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is the first spiral that I ever played, Kon. Audio seems a little loud, Kon. Let me know. At least on my side, it looks like it. But it could be. It could be fine. Okay, let's continue, Kun. Or... Or not, Kun? Guess we have to beat all the enemies. Okay, okay, there we go. Whoa! Oh, what is that cone? You can strafe around the enemies by holding L1. Oh, glowy thing? Glowy thing? The only glowy thing I see is uh, my partner. Oh! Burnham, holly thicket, green blossom cone. Oh, 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 got smacked. Oh, goodness! Why do they have a bat? Why do they have a bunking bat? Oh, the dragonfly thought it was something from the stage? No, no, no. Oh! Die already! Oh, I'm out of fire! <gasps> no! No! Ah! It 
died, Con. Uh, I'm not good at this, Con. Oh, why is he right behind me, Con? Oh. Oh, this is a contastrophe. <laughs> okay, one down, Con. Give me the HP, Con. Let me work on him. Woo! Oh. Okay. We got this, Con. It was just a silly mistake the first time, Con. Woo! Waiting for him to take out his bonk bat. There we go. Hello, Alex! Welcome in, welcome in. Good to see you. We're having a great day. Go on. Okay. Three in a row. What a combo. Oh, there's monkeys down there. Should I? Let's get this one first. Let's, let's call these ones up here first, Go on. And then go down here, Kun. Need all the HP we can get, Kun. Spiral the dragon. Okay. Oh! Almost missed that, Kun. Platforming, Kun. Our favorite. Oh! Oh no, that was almost bad, Con. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that, Con. <laughs> oh, we're scaredy cons. What in the world was that? I have no idea, but I'm going this way, far from it. Which brings us to the moment that Spyro's journey really began. Dun dun dun. Finally met again for the very first time. Oh, it's a long story. Or should I say, con con con? Goodness. <laughs> you're, you're alive, but it's too late. Too late. T too late for what? Who are you? Do you know me? Where do I come from? What are you? What are we? What am I? You mean you don't know? Does it sound like he knows? You're a dragon. When you were just an egg, it was my job to protect you. How did we find him, Kong? To protect all of you. There are others? Others? There were. There were four of us. Guardians, that is. And we had one job. Ensure that... Will the cones ever swear. end, Kong? In uh, uh, half an hour, Kong. After all. And our very survival depended on those eggs. At the temple. And Grotto are now gone. Overrun by Temple. What Darn gone. <laughs> Can you take it? Can I see it? Where I came from, I mean? No, no, no. Who knows what West Virginia Ma what Mama Take me home. Country gone. <laughs> and no it will continue. Think of it behind the con. Look at the hex con. The prophecies spoke of a purple dragon. A dragon born only once every ten generations. You. You. Does that mean him? Oh, wait. This guy, Spyro, some special once in a purple thing? <laughs> I think you might uh, mix that one up. Whoa, that's a little bit of a stretch. I've heard some uh, doozies in my day, but that takes the cake. Spyro, is it? Well, Spyro, I assure you that I'm telling you the truth. The Dark Armies attacked intent. Oh, think of it, that Pat's gone. The rest of us. And they nearly succeeded. And then they lay siege to the other islands. We were at war. I can see the war in his eyes, gone. For many years, <laughs> we fought all over the islands. 
Your troll clashes with the armies of the Dark Master, who was intent on preventing the prophecies from coming true. The other three guardians and I led our small but valiant forces into battle after battle against our ruthless mercenary foe. And when we were beginning to turn the tide, Cinder came. Oh! Cinder? Cinder gone. He is monstrous, horrific, ferocious, a black dragon that fills the skies with terror, an unstoppable force of nature. Gone, gone, yeah, gone. You had me at ferocious. <laughs> Listen, sounds like that thing that was chasing us, Spyro. Yes, she still searches for me. And years ago, I watched as Cinder plucked the other guardians from the fields of battle. Like so many ripe grapes from a vine. Oh. Without them, our cause is lost. Rest in Only peace, gone. I, Ignite, managed to escape. Not that it matters. Cinder now rules all, and I sit here wondering what might have been, what else I might have done. Wow. Sounds fun. I want to hang out with this guy. Me too, Gon. I haven't given up. I just find out that I'm this special dragon, and you tell me all is lost? That I have no home or family left? I've come way too far to give up now. I want to see where I come from. Hold up, Savior Boy. Were you not listening to this guy? He's talking about flying dragons and war and horrible... This is bad stuff, all right? I don't know if we're hearing the same thing. Yes, Spyro. It's not as simple as that. It's true, the prophecies spoke of the purple dragon destined to put his stamp on this age. But the prophecies didn't foretell the devastation that surrounds us now. Maybe you're right, but I'm willing to try. I want to take the first step. You're actually going to go along with this lunatic. Very well then. We'll go. You deserve to see your beginning before it all ends. Am I the only one sane here? He's telling us we're doomed, all right? That's when I go, ah, maybe we should, you know, go back to the forest with the flowers and the fun stuff. Hello, Lori Korn! Hello, Hakko's Korn! Welcome back, I hope you're both having a great day, Korn. We skip the devastation part from the prophecies? Yeah, that seems like a lot to tell, Korn. You gotta, you gotta minimize details in prophecies. Welcome in, Jumbo Korn! Hope you're having a good day, Korn. Con, con, con. Cinder's soldiers must have knocked the other two statues out of place. Heathens. What other two statues? On the other side of this door are two statues just like these. When all four statues are positioned correctly, the door opens. Whoa, yeah, Con, who would have guessed? Spyro, I need you to get in there and move the statues in place. Me? How? There's a small tunnel that animals use to access the caves. Find it and use it. Yeah, animals are... Okay, you know what? You do that and I'll wait here. Having lunch? Oh, I hope you have a good lunch, John. Well, go on. Congrats on reaching the con. Thank you, con. Yes, it's very exciting, con. That's very nice today, Quan. Very generous. Yeah, we are playing some Spyro Quan. I open the door if they already have a tunnel because he uh, Ignitus doesn't fit in the tunnel, Quan. You mean Quan? Congratulations, yes, Quan. The spider scream sounds so weird, Gon. What is this, Gon? Nothing? Okay, Gon. He's not going to help leave him behind? No, he will help, Gon. He has to teach us how to be a dragon, Gon. We don't know how to be a dragon. So it seems like... Enemies are invulnerable until we... 
until they are properly ready to attack us, Kun. So we need to remember that. Woo! Welcome in, Savino Kun! Hello, hello! Hope you're having a good day, Kun. Hey, when in doubt, break it, right? Go nuts! Press X, X, and then hold circle to perform a tail strike, Gon. Okay, Gon. Wow! Oh! Push the dragon busts into their holes, Gon. I'm getting attacked by spiders. Give me a moment, Gon. Why are you spinning? Cone spiders don't spin. Hey, stop it, Cone. You stop that. At least these spiders aren't scary, Cone. Are they just going to keep dropping, Cone? Until I, I do the statues? Seems like it. Yes. Okay. How do we push the statues into place, Kwon? You heckin' hate spiders, Kwon? I am not a huge fan of spiders, but these ones... They're not that scary. They could be worse, Kwon. Oh, okay, you just run into them. Alright. So let's get rid of this guy. He's really annoying, Kwon. I really wish there was another way to push this, Kwon. Alright, we got one. Oh, are they all gone now, Kwon? No, they're not. The, the sound is still there, Kwon. There they are, Kwon. <gasps> we got him in! Let's go, Kwon. You see his big dragon, Kwon. Any trouble? A little insect. Griffin is spiraling out of this world, Kwon. Hello, Aretha Kwon. We're having a good day. The past is prelude to tomorrow, a dim promise. Allow us entrance. Do not reject us. Are you making that up? It should open for us. There is a disturbance. It seems my fears have been realized. They desecrated the interior as well. Guess we'll oh. have to open it the old-fashioned way. Uh oh, Make your way through the connecting rooms, restoring every statue you can find. He walks like his legs are hurting. Ign ignite is gone. My help. Money well. Hop up. All right. The old guy's coming to life. Griffin, how are you doing today, friend? I'm doing good, gone. Doing good. How are you, gone? Zender's forces are surely on their way. Okay, Frangulan! Have a good evening, Kon! Thank you so much for hanging out, Kon! Yes, Ignite is- Oh, I see, Kon. Doing okay, good to hear, Kon! I'll see you later, Kon! Okay, Kon! Goodbye, Kon! <laughs> hey, Spiral, what was that about? I don't really know. I just felt like I had to hit it. And when I did, the power of a thousand suns surged through my body. Right. Yeah, okay. Well, you know what? You should really sleep better. You know, I'm gonna stop bugging you. You really need to get eight hours. <laughs> Forget I said anything. Let's go. <laughs> Hello, Zero Code. Yes, I did get my eight hours of sleep, Code. <laughs> I did indeed. Speaking of sleep. <laughs> but that, that's a big mood, Cone Spyro. That's a bit. That's a big. That's a big mood. Have, just feeling like you have to hit something, Kwon. and then feeling like, uh, like uh, you 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 got the the power of a billion suns in you, Kwon. Oh, what was that, Kwon? What was that? Something exploded, Kwon. Burn the 
the monkeys gone? Or baboons, whatever you want to call them. I like how each, uh, each enemy has its own name, Gon. They're not the same name as Gon. Hopefully this game doesn't feel like it's dragging long on longer than it should, Gon. I think it should be fine. I looked it up, it said... Uh, it, the game takes like six hours to beat Gon. So we'll probably get to finish it pretty quick. Can you relate to Spyro right now? I just woke up and it's 12.18. <laughs> That's usually me, Gon. That's usually me. I woke up at uh, like 8-ish today, Gon. And then I stayed in bed until like... Oh, a little after 9, Gon. It was just too warm, Gon. Which way do we go now, Gon? This way? This way, yes. Need the crystals, Gon. Don't know what they do. I guess they just give us HP and... Uh, mana, Gon? No! Turn the key, Gon. <gasps> oh, Gon. That's quite an entrance, young. There might be hope for us yet. Oh, he is walking like he's hurt, Con. Maybe he did get hurt. What are these things? These are spirit gems. A gift from the ancestors. Griffin's saying that because she's too comfy, gift. yeah. A gift that speaks across generations. A gift that empowers you with the spirit of the past. Strengthening you with the wisdom of the ages. I feel more powerful already. Smash the gem clumps. Collecting blue gems will increase your spirit energy. Used to upgrade your breaths through the level up upgrade screen on the pause menu. Gone. Give me those blue gems. Yummy blue gems. Gone. Yum yum yum. Blue flavor. Best flavor. Gone. Yeah, I think he's hurt, exactly Con. what I feared. Look, Spyro. Perhaps we should turn back. What? After coming this far? If this door is closed, it means there are intruders behind. It's how the temple protects itself. Uh, yeah, it doesn't work too well, does it? So, what are you saying, Ignitus? What I'm saying is the only way the door will open... Don't say it! Is if the intruders are kicked out of there. Didn't we got I this, Gon. Say, don't say it. Try to find a way to break through the wall, Gon. Probably got wounded in the big fight, Gon. Yeah. Well, we don't have enough, Gon. I can keep the bad puns coming. Co co con me? Wait. What was that? Oh, What was that? What is that? Find a way to break through the wall, con. Err. Err. What the con? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hit the hard, real hit the wall really hard. Always works, gone true. Well, that didn't work. That didn't work. Oh. <gasps> Cannot take a co not take any more puns. <laughs> there we go, we did it, Gon. Get the yummy blue gems, nom 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 gon. Oh, 
What is that gone? Oh, it's just a barrier gone. Time to fight the bad guys and engage in mortal combat. Wow. Oh! That one scared me, Gon. Uh oh, one's behind me, one's behind me. Okay, I'm gonna stop monkeying around, Gon. Oh, yummy jumps gone. Convince him of the error of his ways. Got this one. Getting away from that. Drop the TNT right by his feet, Gon. You know, you think it was hard to make up all these names for these enemies, Gon? Because they are all unique names, Gon. Oh, what is this gone? Oh, TNT barrel gone. Let's blow it up. Ignite the fuse with your fire blast gone. Pia. <laughs> Let's go gone. That's a dragon. Welcome in, Rashcon. Hope you're having a good day. Oh yes, if any of you want to follow my Twitter, join my Discord, check out my YouTube, Twitch, or Throne. There are all my links in the chat. Go on. Good morning, Sir Mars Gon. Hope you're having a great day. Spiral loved that little guy, Hakyakon. your guardian buddies, but you managed to escape our clutches. Until now. Oh. Stand back, Spiral. And let me show you what a dragon trained in the ancient ways can do. Oh. What the con? Why have we been doing all the fighting, con? Whoa, the big guy's got some moves. Yeah, con. Okay, Ignitus? Yes. As I get older, it takes longer to recover. Oh, that's so many gems gone. You are incredible, Ignitus. Can you show me how to do that? Patience, young dragon. Soon enough, you'll learn all I have to teach. But right now, you must fight. No, let me get the gems gone. Let me get the gems gone. I go back for the gems. Go, go, go. Go back, go back. No! No, they closed the door, Con. Locked me in here, Con. Uh, Rish's doing okay. Just started a little sick, but happy to be here. I hope you feel better soon, Con. How's the coffee, Fox? I'm doing okay, Con. Uh, hopefully not losing my voice, Con. You've been confined in here with the monkeys, yes, Gon. 
can't monkey around no more, Kun. They jumped on the bed too many times. I wonder whose idea it was, Kun, to like... Unique name every single one of these monkeys, Kun. <laughs> oh! Green circle. If Cinder's forces were here, there will certainly be more of them in the temple. Oh, goody. They won't be there for long. Wonderful, now he's getting cocky. Someone was bored and just did it, I bet, Colin. <laughs> but see, that means that each of these monkeys had to be like unique mobs and everything. That's a lot of work, Colin. I'm sad I couldn't go get those crystals he left behind, Colin. I mean, they probably used the same model Kun, but they each had a unique identifier and corresponding name Kun. Still, they'd have to go into like the, the database and like correspond each of those Kun. Gameplay balancing, they had to know how many enemies they were putting on the field each time enemy. Anyway, true Kun. True, true, true. It's just a little detail Kun that's uh, not really seen these days. And I personally feel like it might have been a little over overkill Kun, because these monkeys are. Uh, I don't think it matters really their name. I don't think their names matter that much, Kun. All good, Kun? Or not, Kun? Oh, he's walking, Kun. Okay. Can't even jump on him, Kun. Maybe they liked making these names and wanted to add the names as a nice detail. True, Kun. True. Face gone. I can't tell if he's happy or if he wants to cry, Gone. What happened here? This is what Cinder has done. Put all the islands under her iron rule. If I wanted to see where I came from. I didn't know it was going to be like this. Oh. Yeah, no offense, but this place is a bit of a dump. This was once our home, Spyro. Welcome in SB on Corn. Hello, hello. We can make it our home once again. Reclaim what's rightfully ours. What do you mean? I mean that my time for heroics has passed. But with your help, we might be able to beat Cinder. I can't, Ignitus. I just learned what I am. You can, Spyro. You can. You are a purple dragon. A very special creature. 
You've given me hope again. And now it's time to give hope to all of them. I'm not sure what help I can be, Ignitus, but I'll try. I'll try. <laughs> Good. That's all I can ask. Now come with me. I have something for you. The style you used earlier is cruel, archaic, and obvious. But you got the job done. Not bad, considering you haven't been taught anything about what it means to be a dragon. Thanks. As if you're going to have a chance against Cinder and her army, you're going to need to learn a lot more. Oh, good school. <laughs> Unlike any school you've ever known, young friend. Now it's time to unleash the true dragon within you. Oh. Each of the guardians is master of an element. As you may have surmised, I'm master of fire. Pay attention, and you may be someday too. Let's begin. Oh, you seem to have training room now. To breathe fire on your own. That's very impressive and uncommon. But now let's see if you can master it. Press an alt square to burn the attacking dummies with your fire blast gun. Uh, I mean, putting the names to all the enemies isn't that big of an investment of game memory, Gon. They use up so much for the voice acting already, Gon. All the names in the game probably take up as much space as one line of spoken dialogue at most, Gon. I see, I see. Good young Spyro. Sometimes the stream lags. Is that because of YouTube or because of something else? Um, nothing that I know of. I have it on like ultra low latency, so it shouldn't um, be lagging far behind um, the live. Oh, chase after the dummies, something square to burn them with their fire blast when they're in range to beat all the dummies before the time limit expires. Oh, goodness. Hmm. I'm gonna cheat a little bit. I can run! We have two left, chat. the enemies in the conflagration oops sir pro caps spyro you must learn that there is a time and a place for everything the ability to breathe fire well done your training is just getting started over here knocking enemies up into the air allows many opportunities for continued attacks This way, oh Marv one. Let us see how well you can improvise with your abilities. Okay. Thank you, Sarah, for lurking in the YouTube. Also, I've got my I mean coffee. I'm ready to sip. No sip. Thank you for the lurk, Sarah. Thank you, thank you, Gon. Combo attack. Oops. Oops. 
How the heck? Okay, so we don't need to link it, we just need to do this. Oh, thank you for that pass! There we go. Oh, thank you for that, Andrew, go on! Back to work, I'll catch the stream later. Okay, Jomo, go on! Have a good day at work, thank you for hanging out, go on! Hope you had a good lunch, go on! You did it! And now it's time to move on. It's time to move on, Kon. Let us continue. Press circle uh, four times, three times, knock it into the air, and then press X, circle, 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 jump up. Okay. Yeah! That's it. That's Easy, Con. When are we learning fire stuff, Con? Let's try another. Press and hold circle, knock dummy into air, XR1. Yeah, Kong. Wait till I tell the folks about this. this We're gonna home. find out our firefly friend uh, ran away from home, Kong. Conserve your energy. And s That's why a motivated dragon can do. It's kind of odd because the um, the attacks are slightly delayed, so I have no many time. I have no idea how many times I actually press the button. Con. Uh circle X R one. Oh, repeat five times. Are we supposed to hit them into each other, Kong? <gasps> no! No! What the con? You barely begun. An off-balanced enemy can be very useful. Yes. Okay, Con, we need to hit them into each other five times. Last one, Con. Oh, just barely, Con. You're ready to proceed. Over here. Let's see if you can. Knock the dummy into the air, then knock it away to the group of smaller dummies, Con. Get away from me, Con. 
Who <laughs> did it first strike on? Way, oh, Marv one. Spyro, you have taken Stay behind the elemental wall and press triangle to throw surprised. fireball to smash the targets. When did we learn fireball? This is new. Okay. Ah, I that was close. You, Spyro. Spyro, come here. Now let's mix it up. Oh goodness. Do you like Pokemon? I don't like Pokemon Zero Corn. Oh goodness. We're like a sneeze away from dying. Oh. Oh, thank God, corn. So we did it. So good. Now for the real oh, that was so scary. What's your favorite type in Pokemon of that type? For me, it's fighting in Lucario. Uh, probably grass and Bulbasaur. Corn. We have to go here, okay. You have demonstrated the ability to control and manipulate fire, Spyro. After defeating small dummies, press R2 to the defeat the now larger dummies. The fire Fury. Okay. Okay. I assume that's the purple bar. They never explain the purple bar. the tutorial con for the first dragon hmm. so what's with the poor big guy if you must know certain dragons have the ability to see visions why did he get so cast sassy all of a sudden, Cole? And to see what's happening in places far, far away. I am one such dragon, and in this pool, visions come forth. Oh, really? Is that so? Okay, what am I thinking now? What am I thinking now? Okay, now. Now. Now, 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 now. I'm afraid it's not that easy, Sparks. It takes time, reflection, and patience. What I do see in the Pool of Visions is that Voltia, one of the Guardians, is being held on Dante's freezer. Oh. Spyro, 
While I look for details on the others, I want you to venture there and find out what you can. Remember, just look around. If you encounter Cinder, run. You're not ready to face her yet. Okay, so when people are trying to kill me, I run? Got it. But, Ignitus, how do we get there? I'm glad you asked. Why are you smiling? I don't like it. Look, Vincent, don't be gone. Hope you're having a good day. You're saying that I can fly? Maybe you've been hanging in those caves a little too long, old man. Spyro can't fly, we all know that. Yeah, a bit of fresh air might do you good. I've, I've never flown in my life. It's you that will be getting some fresh air, Spyro. Now, close your eyes, take a deep breath, and empty your mind. Yes, yes, that's it. Now feel the power of your ancestors coursing through your body. In and then push us off a cliff. They will come to you and teach you. Unlocking powers you never knew you had. Boy, this I gotta see. Just forget everything you ever thought you knew. Forget yourself. Only through forgetting will you remember what your ancient blood already knows. You can fly. We learned how to fly in chat. We can fly corn. Corn Airlines now taking off. <laughs> Are you kidding? He's flying. Welcome to the club, big guy. Would that be the annoying pest club? No, smart Alec, the flying club. Yeah, I could get used to this. Meow. <laughs> Oh, 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 okay. Use R1 to speed up and L1 to slow down. We flying level, let's go, come. Press triangle to shoot homing fireball. So we're gonna run into enemies, I guess. Oh, thank you for the headpads, come. Press X while holding left or right on the left analog stick. Out the barrel roll! Do a barrel roll! Oh, big! What is that? What is that? That's not a turtle! What is that? Crustacean? Little barrel roll! Woo! Can't catch me! Heck yeah! Box and coffee cups that you don't see every day. Heck yeah! Oh goodness, Con. It's getting hectic out here, Con. Uh-oh. 
bad boat. What did I do? Welcome in, trash boat. Go on. Hope we're having a good day. What if you're fighting the people from How to Train Your Dragon? Oh no. Welcome in, Lord Pancelot. Hello, hello. Hope you're having a good day. Oh my goodness, Kong. Why are, why are all these monkeys just hanging out here? They gotta be freezing, Kong. Oh goodness. Are we almost there, Kong? Oh! No. <gasps> We're there, I think. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day. Welcome on in. Welcome in, Robomon. Good to see you. Supersonic racing. Making me want to play Spyro now. Heck yeah. Dante's okay, back to work. Okay, so we have a have good time. Thank you for hanging out. Soldiers and weapons frozen forever in the posture of destruction. You must find Voltir before he's lost forever. How the heck do I land? Coming in too fast. This doesn't look good. Incoming! That's gonna hurt. <gasps> nice landing, Ace. Yeah, maybe this flying thing ain't for me. Well, it sure doesn't help that you're carrying all that weight. You know, throw a salad Ugh. in every once in a while. You might be okay. <laughs> what yeah, the heck? I, I think I'll stick to the ground for a while. Good idea. Not exactly a friendly place, huh? Wonder where we should start. That crystal well, right in front of us, heck yeah. Maybe we should take that clearly marked path that leads to the interior. Rough landing. Does pro work for Ryan Air? Ryan Air. Well, that's an enemy, hundred percent. Is it weird that that blinked at me? Just keep moving. Uh, ice cubes alive. Oh. Okay. I want the crystal. Let me get the Why crystal gone. to knock that bad boy down. I knew I brought you along for a reason. I had a puppy, and every time I was holding it and then put it on the floor, it stretched its paws like I know that's how you land, Colin. Exactly, Colin. The trees to make snowballs fall down, push them in the catapult to prepare them for firing them. Interesting. Okay. Oh! Monkey! Okay, so we need to push those into the catapult. Oh, this grab's a lot easier than that statue earlier. Hit the catapult to throw it. Ouch. Grab this, bring it back over here. Whoop. Whee! Look, my Oculus. Good to see you. We're having a good day. That was a good idea. Glad I thought of it. You glad you know. <laughs> Having fun with Spyro, I am. <laughs> Collecting purple gems will give you fury energy. Oh, hey, they're explaining it finally. Meow. 
Wait, something's not right here? What's up? Look at that name chat. Uh, Umkeeb. Um, Umkeeb. His name is Umkeeb. Warcraft Admirer, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Hope you have a wonderful day. We have a good time here. Also, Hug, thank you so much for the gifts of the Oculus. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. How does someone even come up with that name? I have no idea. That's why I pointed it out. Did you take any like school classes or something? Or do you uh, do this YouTube and Switch stuff? Or are you self-taught? I'm self-taught. I didn't even know that there were even classes for this kind of thing. I didn't even touch him. Why did he die? Why did he die? I didn't even touch him. What the heck? All right. Well, game's just going easy on me. Spyro's kicking butt and taking names? Heck yeah. Thought you landed on him? I don't think I even landed on him. I think I was just about to touch him and then he just died. I didn't even get to hit him. Kicking names, taking butt? You were about to touch who? The monkey that died. Welcome in Yamamoto! Good to see you. Hope you're having a great day. Oh, there was a big old monkey throw in. Uh... Oh, this music's so loud. <laughs> there was a monkey throwing stuff at me, like that one. And uh, he, I just went up to him and before I could even hit him, he died. I have the original Spyro on a demo disc that came with my original PlayStation. I always played the heck out of that thing. I've actually never played the original Spyro. This is the first Spyro I've ever played before. So I figured we'd uh, try it again. Yeah, I played this one and then I played Dawn of uh, New Dragon. I didn't even play the second one for, for this trilogy, <laughs> apparently. I didn't even know it existed. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. I love monkey. Gee, this is more fun than a barrel of monkeys. Oh my goodness. So, so many less polygons. The original was rough, but fun. Nice. Also, let me know if the audio is ever too high or too low, chat. Yeah, sometime we're gonna have to play the Reignited Trilogy. I think I have it. I think I have it on Steam. Just I haven't gotten around to it because I I would like to stream it, but I wanted to start with these first because these were my first ones. Okay, got all the crystals. Let's go, chat. Ooh, wait. How do we get past this? We just go over here. Oh. Err. Err. Wait just a second. Game could possibly be 5% louder, but that's not picking. Oh, so it's not quiet, it's loud? Okay. Err, it's not quiet. It's not loud, it's quiet. Okay. I figured it would be uh, loud. I turned it up a little bit. How do I get past this guy? Oh, stop peeing on me! I'm not into it! I'm not into it, stop! There we go, okay. That was really tricky to get past. Oh. You think 
out with Cinder? Uh, I sure hope so. What? Well, if, if it wasn't, it means there's more than one giant evil dragon around here. Uh oh. Yeah, I hope that was Cinder too. I don't have to train after wrapping up some work at a practice site to go to. Set some stuff up for them and got drenched to my bones. Oh no, say so. I'm sorry to hear that. Hey Griffin, welcome in X Men. Good to see you. We're having a great day. I don't know if they're requested for that stuff, so that's why I asked. Oh yeah, no, I've uh, learned all this stuff on my own. Lots of lots of Google searching and stuff. Yeah, get dry soon. Don't get sick. Oh goodness. Scroll the undead. Oh, why is he so oh, okay? Okay, 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 okay. okay. So he's he yeah he's an undead he's an undead yep yep he's an undead definitely most certainly an undead uh oh I'm stuck in a corner ah are you inside a cappuccino or a frappe I'm inside a hot chocolate pop in the clever how do you come up with that name chat. Ambivaloid. Ambivaloid. How do you come up with the name Ambivaloid? <laughs> what the heck? F's in the chat for Ambivaloid. <laughs> How in the world do you come up with a name like that? Oh, hey! The undead guy died because of his ally. Nice. Sound like some kind of medicine? It really does. Yeah. He do be an ambivalist fellow. There's just some names in here are just weird. Very weird. Grab my snowball. The names in this game are creative, if nothing else, exactly. We got like... Oh, I forgot what that one was we saw earlier. Um, umbid or something like that, and then... We got... we got... Umbivaloid? No soup for you! Okay, well... What? Why did you just throw yourself off? Okay. What? Try again. Why did you just throw yourself off, Spyro? We were flying. We know how to fly, remember? <laughs> he just eaten himself. <laughs> you see him do a barrel roll off the cliff, chat? Okay, maybe that's not the way we go. Maybe we go this way. However, he didn't have to do that. He did not have to do that. At all. He did not have to do that. <laughs> you don't. <laughs> hey, this is maybe not the way to go. You don't just barrel roll off the cliff. <laughs> what does say so mean, by the way? It means that I don't do a whole lot of swearing. Uh, I'm not super um, sussy. I'm pretty safe for work. Translates to pure yes. <gasps> wait, we learned we learned electric stream. Ooh. Press left to select the electricity element in the future. You can upgrade this breath further. Oh, we died. Wholesome. Yes, wholesome. Say same thing. Wholesome say so. We learned electricity, chat. Um I was doing some work from home stuff on my computer and I just heard you say that and I was like, wait, what did I say? Oh no. We 
Yeah. There we go. And every chance you say so, yeah, say so, like wholesome. Puke spawn the terrifying. Look at that name chat. Puke spawn. Blaze mind of the resurrected. Puke spawn the terrifying. Puke. Oh, imagine being named Puke Spawn. Oh, oh, to be named the little guy named Puke Spawn. <laughs> Cinder Chain, Chill Shiver, Chill Shiver. Sydney the Hungry. Okay, Sydney. It's like it's okay. I don't even think we need to do this anymore, but... Charge Drip the Covetous, Dark Sludge the Demon... Fill the Famished, Slash Soak the Rancid. They really like giving people titles. What are you? Rock Thought. Hello, Rock Thought. <laughs> I'm just so great to respond to my screen name. So many things. Just now for reaction. I peeked my head up and I was jumping to what did I do this time? Understandable, say so. The fun of this game is just the names, really. I don't think anything is gonna top ambivaloid though. Or anything close to it, I just immediately pop my head up. Understandable. Yeah, it's really weird hearing my name because I'm like, no, I'm Griffin. Hello, Fall Pixies! Welcome in, welcome in! Happy Fall Fox Fest Day 2, thank you! Thank you so much! Hope you're having a wonderful day! Is say so, say so? Say so, say so, say so, say so? Say so, say so, say so. <laughs> oh! Boss time? If you say so, say so. <laughs> Snow Spectre. Star Falls with a Z. Easton Creek. Unless I'm doing commentary event for Sprite Corner, then I'm well behaved. Bronze Ghoul, the dis di disinter. Hello, Tila! Welcome and welcome and good to see you! We're having a great day! Okay, so up is fire. Left is... electric. No, right is electric. There we go. I said some extremely out-of-pocket things. I feel like we all have at one point or another. Oh, stop it! I don't want any more! Just give me the shiny blue gems. They're tasty. This music's getting really intense, chat. Coin... Coin crash? Cut lover. Ant. Ant the warrior. I like how they just throw some normal names in there. Rockford the hungry. I'm sorry you're hungry, buddy. I'll 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 fix you. I'll fix you. No more hungry for you. Never be hungry again. You don't have a tummy now. Two more. Okay. Alright, I'm getting tired of this. We're going big mode. Oh. 
intense, mu intense music's usually for boss fights. It, it seems like it's going that way. With all of these waves of enemies. Silimer, Natil, Kazi. Gunbait, Dusk Jackal. Gunbait, you are gunbait. Gunbait, wah! <laughs> uh oh, there's some TNT right there. I thought the same thing. Gun bait. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, got him. Anyone else? No? I assume I go this way. Back from out town, welcome back, say so. That's a funny laugh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Griffin, have you ever heard someone say Griffin IRL and then unconsciously, unconsciously think that they were talking to you? Yeah, all the time. Okay, 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 okay. You guys need to chill out. What? Oh my goodness. Yeah, I tell Hudo to just call me Griffin. So that way, whenever he says my actual name, I know we're being like serious, serious. And it also depends on the company, but I'm like really used to being called Griffin. I I am a big uh, big introvert, so I I have gotten very used to being called Griffin from having online friends for so long. It's just weird hearing my name. It's really cool. Do you refer to Hudo as Hudo in person too? Yes. <laughs> Unless I'm being serious, serious, and then, and then I'll call him his name. <laughs> uh, that's our. That, that's how we know we're being serious. We use our names. <laughs> Otherwise, we, we use our our online usernames usually. <laughs> uh oh, I'm all out of magic. Gribonius. Guess it's like when your parents call you by your full name? Exactly, Hug. Exactly. <laughs> Yo, Oculus, exactly. What about being called Evil Emperor Griffin? No. No, I'm not- I'm not an Evil Emperor. Playing Pokemon Go, I'll sometimes forget someone's name, so I'll talk to them with the in-game name. That's understandable. If I heard my first and middle name get called by my parents, I knew my life was about to end. <laughs> So true, so true. <laughs> this seems like a icicles falling from the roof kind of thing. Oh hey, I was right! Except I can't see anything. They turned the camera around. Oh, I'm all out of running power. Oh, thank god we didn't get stabbed there at the end. Whoa! Wait, is he blowing that up for me? Yo! Yo! That monkey's on our side, chat. He blew up their tower for me. 
He's such a nice monkey. So my cat does when she finishes her food in the middle of the night. She lights a fuse to my bedroom at like five or six and tries to end me. Any funny haha -ha names in here? There's the Larbo. Bohavian. Gun bait, wah ha ha. I'm still, I still can't get over that one. Gun bait, wah ha ha. We've really been already streaming for two hours, chat. That's crazy. Been having so much fun with this game. Bubaloid just goes way too hard, it really does. <laughs> and Bubaloid and gun bait. You just can't get any better. Etanoba? Rockadoo? Rockadoo. I like Rockadoo. Is it Rockado? I think it's Rockado actually. Ha ha he kev. His name is just GV. His name was just GV. Man, whoever named these guys must have had a lot of fun with it. Or hated his job, I'm not sure which. It was probably really hard coming up with all these names. Okay, what do we got now? But they had a name generator? Probably, yeah. Oh, <gasps> ooh, new enemy chat. Snow Spectre. Can't wait to see John Spyro. Man, we are just killing this guy left and right. He does not like fire. I that was I thought that was gonna be harder than it was. Oh, there's another there oh numerous. Okay, okay, never mind. Never mind, I take it back. You know what I do? I just go right here and I do this. If I see John anything I might laugh so hard I'll pee myself. Tingle the ghoul. Tingle the ghoul. Okay, that, that was a name. <laughs> Definitely looked like a tingle. Okay, okay. He's a real one. <laughs> Did he die in Zelda and come to Spyro to retire? Apparently. Oh, stop going over them. Now he died in Spyro, so he's going back to Zelda? Heck yeah. Woo! Oh no! No, 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 no! No, 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 we have like a bear, a ba 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 baby, baby sliver of HP left. What do I do? We got the baby HP. Oh! When did they get projectiles? Ready? I always wondered why in old school. 
Um, beat em up games? They gave every random enemy a name? I have no idea. They have aimbot? They do. They're cheating. Hello, you know! Welcome in, welcome in! Good to see you! Oh, this guy's apparently too big to... Uh, throw around. Better be a bit more careful. You're telling me. Oh, they're just standing there, blocking the entrance. Hello, you know. Hope you're having a good day. Welcome in, welcome in. Oh! Stop! Stop it! Oh! Oh no! Uh-oh. I'm all out of magic again. Come fight me. Woo! Come on, I just need to kill one. I just need to kill one. Oh, no, 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 no! <gasps> ah, at least I kind of keep my progress when I die. Urgh. Bomb him! Those are fire bombs. They spawn camp, don't smack you, frame one, which is wild, yeah. Oh, it's wild how it, or it's weird how it just drops you back in the middle of the enemies when you die, yeah. Oh, wait, wait, we got. Well, I just got HP, what the heck? Also, yes, if anyone wants to follow my Twitter, join my Discord, check out my YouTube, Twitch, Arthur Row, and there are all my links in chat. Rest her on my card. It's gonna take a few tries, but we got this. How did I do this when I was younger, chat? I feel like I cheesed this. I don't even remember this area. Okay. HP. Oh, we did it, chat. We did it. Ah, oh, good HP. Just jump over that now, and then break these, get our HP back up. We won the fight! Yeah! Ooh, cha, we have enough purple. Fire bomb of smoke and flame. What's better than a firebomb explosion? An even bigger one. Press and hold X to upgrade this breath. Hmm? I guess I can't? Fire Blast of the Blazing Skies. Oh, okay, so we have our breath here. And then we have our bomb down here. I see. Uh... <laughs> tastes like purple? Yep. Electric stream surge and current fire frozen through them around using a supercharged zapper. I think I want this one. Press and hold X. Oh, there we go. Alright. Can we do one of each of these? I don't know how much purple we have. More voltage. Oh, that's draining the tank. That's draining the tank. Uh-oh. That, that hurt a little bit. That hurt a little bit. Tank's empty. Maybe that's why the fight was so hard. We haven't done that yet. Another open area. Time for more enemies.
Oh, he's in the circle. He's in the circle. Oh no, he's out of the circle. Oh god. Let me out. Come on, come on. Don't die now, don't die now! Alright. Get our HP back up real quick. Woo! Get that away from me! Welcome to the 10 Good to see you. Hope you're having a great day! Oh god. That is a bigger fire breath. Definitely. I can tell the difference. Oh, he's in here! Oh! Finally, landscapers are finishing up last bit of leaf blowing. Nice! Oh! Not nice. Not nice! Oopsie. There's just so much going on at once. No! Oh, he got me against the- against the wall! That's cheating! Where'd he go? Get him! They are concluding! Let's go! Also, the cons are concluded. We- I actually did it for over an hour, honestly. Let's have a little bit of fun with it. Door? Rickety door? No more cons, no more cons. Ah, oh, yes, Sog! Thank you for gifting the ton of gifts up earlier. Thank you, thank you! Get rid of these monkeys. There we go. Oh! I love getting weather hazard notifications on my days like this where it's cold and stormy and they say beach hazard. I know they have they have to, but it's like who's going swimming at Lake Michigan right now? True. Said nothing and let her continue. So when I didn't say anything when it went over for like, uh, for over an hour, yeah. Oh, thank you for the hydrates! Oh, thank you, thank you. I do need it. Do you do need the hydrate, me chat, so I don't lose my voice. Oh, didn't mean- I am used to pressing triangle to open the main menu. Let me hydrate really quick. It's weird the menu doesn't even have music. Have you been upgrading your skills? Yeah, we just upgraded them. Working on... This one right now. The menu feels so weird to get around. Oh, we're so close. So it, instead of pressing up to get to the, the between the fire things, you have to press left and right. That's very weird for me. And then left and, and then up and down are for these. So let up and down go like this. I guess that kind of makes sense. But then going left to right from the fire things feels really weird. If it was, like, down here, that's a left and right thing. But up here, it feels really weird. Okay. I think we go this way now? Oh, nice! Barrels of crystals. Okay. <gasps> Goober! Cooper! 
We found Goober! We killed Goober! Goober's another good contender. Sorry, Goober. Nothing over here. Break all the tables. I guess I already hit the TNT away. Smack it back at him. That's a big monkey. Smack him, smack him. Ah, oh, there we go, we got him. Break their soup pot. Worst thing you can do to a person, break their soup pot. A lot of TNT. Shlubel? Shlubel. Shlubel. Okay. How in the world? Tenudaso? I didn't even know how to say that one right. I see this. I'm gonna hit these. Lubby. We got a lubby. Sorry, lubby. Some of these just seem like really weird, uh... Really weird names. Where do we go from here? This way, okay. Kinda hard to position our camera sometimes. Okay. Grab these real quick. Get the blue crystals, yummy blue crystals. Go here. Let's finish up this if we can. And then start working on our fire blast of scorched earth. Yeah, this gives not back now, which is nice. I think at some point it also chains. Maybe it already chains. Cackle hyph. Cackle hypho. Yummy blue rock crunch crunch crunch. Heck yeah. Chain lightning, that was always fun in DD. &D. Yeah! For lightning, I imagine that it, like most, oh god, most games it would, uh, chain. Oh, there's stairs right there, chat. We're getting up there. I wonder if we're close to the dragon. Obviously, it's the lightning dragon. I think his name is what, Voltier? Yeah, that's, that's the only way to go is up this way. Okay. Let's go! Another set of enemies up here. No! Just me falling to my death! Ah. Wasn't ready for that. Got to remember my
my training. Gotta remember my training. Okay, Spyro. Uh Training didn't prepare me for this one. Oh wait, yes it did, okay. Never mind. I thought those were gonna break too. Chain lightning in Baldur's Gate 3 on top of water puddle. Ooh, the water puddle. <gasps> oh gosh, oh I thought it was the boss. No! Not more baby enemies! Drop him, drop him, drop him. We got this. Come at me. What? There's no enemies in there. There were no enemies in there. I guess they're just trying to drop bombs on me? That's silly. Dead on impact. Ineffective carpet bombing, yeah. Dreadwing. Sorry, Dreadwing. Dread me. Dreadwing, more like Deadwing. He really doesn't like lightning. Num num. It's over here. Two little guys. In a hole. That apparently I can't go into. Imagine giving me a hole that looks like I could fit in and then not letting me in it. It's crazy. Spyro. Oh, him fell off. Him fell off. Goodbye. Sorry, I know crystals for me. Oh, I did get the crystals. Look at an icy boy elite. Hello, hello. We're having a great day. L ratio. There we go. One left. There we go. Got that one. Now, I assume we go over here. Or... Ooh, maybe not. Oh no, there's more! Oh, now they're dropping enemies again. Okay. Goodness, okay. So I guess we just go backwards? I don't understand which way we go. Because they're dropping enemies back here again. Hi, Hot! Welcome in, welcome in! How are you? How was your stream? Hot Raid! Hello, hello! How was your, how was your stream? What'd you play? So you're playing some retro. What'd you do? What'd you do? Oh my god, that almost hit us. Okay, and that door we can't get in. She was awesome, glad I finally got to raid you for once. Heck yeah! Thank you so much for the raid haunt. We were playing Lost Kingdoms too. It's one of my favorite retro games, period. Nice! I don't think I know that game. Yeah, I don't think I know that one. We're playing Spyro A New Beginning today. Or right now, anyway. Later, we're gonna be, gonna be playing some Dungeons and Dragons. And then, I'm not sure after that. We'll see.
A lot of people don't know it's an obscure GameCube game. Oh, I see, I see. Oh! Come on! Dungeons and Dragons video game? Or are you doing actual D&D stuff on stream? Actual D&D stuff! Welcome in, Garlic! Good to see you! Hello, hello! Okay. One more of these little guys left. Neat! Yeah, I'm excited! It's not uh, very often that we have the D&D the &D group on stream. Oh no! Whoa, what did, I, what did I do just then? How do I make them twist like a... Like, like a Beyblade like that? How do I do that? I need to do that more. I need to figure out how to do that. Make them, make them twirl like a bay blade. But yeah, Han, if you need to go get some food, go get some rest, anything like that, please feel free, don't feel like you need to stay. Feel free to raid and run, thank you so much for the raid, I appreciate it. Did we get a shout out for Han? Not sure if I just couldn't see it because of the pinned message or not. Got it? Oh, thank you! Why do they keep dropping things? What am I supposed to do here? Thank you, I got a shout out. I will lurk when I make dinner. All right, have a good dinner, Han. Oh, I think I'm having pizza for dinner tonight. At least that's what I was told. Oh, we almost died there, chat. There we go, that's how we do that. Oh, but it's about to not be worth it. Nom nom nom. <gasps> no! Oh gosh, dang darn it. We need to figure out which way we, we need to go, chat. On the bright side, this is some pretty good XP, I think. Oh, will it make it? Will it make it? We're so close, we're so close. Just barely, okay. Maybe you're stuck here until you finish off several waves of enemies, maybe. Seems like that's been the case for a lot of part of- a lot of this game. Many parts of this game. I tried to say both of those things at once. <laughs> you go back and forth until they stop spawning? Yeah, I guess so, yeah. That would make sense, I suppose. No more Mr. Bat. He's dead. I don't imagine that they would leave me here in like an infinite kind of grind session. Because then I could just level up all of my stuff right here. Yeah, I'd be able to grind up all my skills. And I'd be pretty OP for the next areas. Hi Frost! Welcome in, welcome in, good to see you! Okay, yeah, there we go. We defeated all the enemies, now it's time to move on. How are you? Good morning, Frost! Maybe we can head this way, Jadius. Mmm! Hey, oh, check this out. Echo. The tunnel that we saw! The, the hole that I said they wouldn't let us in. Nice. Hope your stream's going well so far. It is. Thank you, Frost. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Bet his name's Goober. Good job. Let them all know you're coming. Exactly. They better be afraid. Oh, 
Oh, gee, this one with the ugly sparks. I forgot his name! Oh no, wait, Ambivaloid, yeah. Still nothing like Ambivaloid. Ambivalous fellow. Goodbye, everyone. Be safe and healthy. Thank you for stream. Thank you for coming, Seraphs. Thank you, thank you. Also, those emotes are so cute. Oh my god, those emotes are adorable. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. Thank you, thank you. Have a wonderful day, Sarahs. Thank you for hanging out. Boss room, finally? Finally? I need to sit up. Ugh. Hey, that's him. We did it. Bye. Mm, I don't like this. Yeah, it's too quiet. Too easy. What, e what part was easy? You getting chased by frozen madmen and gorillas? Uh-oh. Uh, sparks. Uh-oh. It's the keeper of the dragon. Chat, gotta fight the ice king. Use the fire for that. Oh, he has a barrier up now. Grab more magic. Just keep throwing, throwing fire bombs at him. This is an easy boss. Oh wait, wait, he's not down yet. Oh, he has another, another phase. Phase two. Now you fight normally. <laughs> Uh-oh. Why am I shooting so high? Let's do it. Oh! Took his barrier down. They're dropping magic, they're dropping magic! Oh, no! We died, we were so close! No! Okay, we, can try again. we can try again, exactly! There's a blue crystal right there I want. Ouch! I hope dragons can, uh... Get their tails back, I think he just like, tore ours off. With that hit. No, turn this way, you! <gasps> oh, we can dodge, chat! Oh my goodness, I didn't know about this. Apparently, except when I, that happens, okay. I think you get crystals from the stal stalactites that fall? I think so, yes. You just learned you can dodge? Yes, I did. Let's do it. Woo! Is 
so many tutorials and none told us how to dodge exactly. They told they told me how to like uh, barrel roll and they told me how to like uh, spin around the enemy. They didn't really necessarily tell me how to dodge. Oh, I'm out of I'm out of magic chat. Hit this! Hit this! Phase three, yeah, phase three. Woo! Well, that didn't help. Over here. Woo! That was close, chat. This HP bar. This HP gem, rather. Woo! Why did that, why does that go so high? Whoa, 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 whoa. chat no 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 oh thank god chat okay 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 we have like barely any hp left Woo. we got sniped in the air what the heck I just have some stuff come through for work, so I'm gonna lurk and work. Alright, say so. Thank you so much for hanging out. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. I hope work goes well. How's that? One of the rest of my workday to be easy? Understandable. He's so close, chat. Okay, did we get him this time? This makes this less... Less imposing by the fact he fell in the snow. A dragon your size defeating that thing. Thank you. That cut very quickly. A purple dragon named Spiral. Amazing. Of course, there were unsubstantiated rumors of a purple dragon countless generations ago. But most considered a hearsay, gossip, legend. It's hard to believe, difficult to fathom, amazing to comprehend. Uh, hmm? Why don't they gag this guy? So much time has passed. So many things have been learned. And now here he is standing right before me. Excuse me, Mr. Vault. What, 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 what is it? Sir, should, shouldn't we get going? Oh, of course. But where to? Well, back to the temple. A friend of yours is waiting. Ignitus? Yes, Ignitus. Of course, much to tell him. Many hypotheses to pose. I... He talks so fast, chat. <laughs> Thunder specialist, I guess, from the color. Yeah. I believe so. His name is also Voltier. You know, Volt, like, Volt what? Yes, yes, Voltier. It's good to see you as well. But we don't have time to waste on sentiment. Back to Cinder. She was doing what to you? She was doing was what to you? Oh, it's hard to be absolutely sure, Ignitus. But it seems she was using me as some sort of suspended organic power source. Uh huh? She was using him as a battery. Why didn't he just say so? Not only that, she also left with a glowing yellow orb. And I believe that I somehow powered it. Does this mean anything to you, Ignitus? Perhaps. Perhaps. What I do know is that we need to rescue the other guardians. It's a PS2 Before game, Sina yes. Can power any more of those orbs. I agree, Ignitus. But first, I'd like to impart some useful knowledge to Spiral. These are being his recently acquired electricity-based exhalation device. What? Well, he says he'd like to teach me some things about that electricity breath. Oi, why didn't you just say so? Okay. Time to for another tutorial, chat.
Quiet. Tutorial part two. Learn our electric breath. Electricity, the spark of life. Listen, and I will teach you its secrets. Press and hold square to shock enemies, something from the target, use your left analog stick, throw enemies into props to shatter them. After dummies, oh, oh, something square shock them with your electric stream when they're in range. Feed all the dummies by the time limit expires. Strawberry jackpot, no. Triangle something, 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 and drop it in a cage in the air. Run up to it and press X to jump to me, and then proceed to melee. Oh. That's what that was. Okay. This way, oh, Mav One. So I think I just do the same thing. two hey why is it going up like that why is it going up like that no, we're gonna have to redo this one chat Focus might prove successful. Okay. More focus. I think I tried to go up. Uh, press trial to throw an electric arc at the fleeing dummies and aerial melee them when caught in the cage. Defeat all the dummies before the time expires. I think I tried to go up, around, and behind them. At least that's what the first one did. True. to that one i'm looking over here what are you doing how do i do this okay we did him their target lock? Not that I know of.
Not, not that I know of that I can manipulate. No! No, he got left out. There we go. Okay, we got him. Three. No! Uh... Dang it. Okay. Guess I'll have to try harder. Why is this one so hard? If it if these things would just go where I was looking, that would help. Also, they are running very fast. Do I need to melee them three times? No, just once? Okay. That could save some time. Try to get this one. There we go. Two left shot. No. No, stop it. What? I swear to God. We're so close, chat. Please tell me that's it, please. Oh, thank God. Okay. That was really close. I hate that. I hate that. Over here. Over here? Oh, okay. So defeat them until I have my fury bar and then R2. We did it! That one was a lot shorter, thankfully. Oh, we've been going for about three hours, so I might take a break for a few minutes. Oh, stretch and stuff. Oh, look, you're the head pads. Oh, they really hydrated Spire. as well. Cyril, the Ice Guardian, was taken to Tall Plains. You and Sparks must go there at once and find him. Yes, sir. But if we see danger, we should run, right? There are times when all of us need to stand up to danger, young Sparks. Yeah, maybe next month, next summer, <laughs> perhaps next year. Just go. Now. Oh, yes, you pushy. All right, Chai, we're going to take a quick break, get some words on stream set up for you guys. Finishing Spyro today. Uh, we'll see how far I get. We'll see how far I get. You spend a few minutes with my doggos, too. Was once home to a proud ancient tribe 
After this cutscene, I guess. How about you? Sparks. The Atlawa were a people in tune with the rhythms of the seasons. Focused on their relationship to crops, their surroundings, their gods. They've all been driven underground by Cinder and her forces, who have taken over the tribe shrine. I sense that's where Cinder is keeping Sil. Trying to power another crystal. You must find him before she succeeds. Right. Never easy. <laughs> Nothing worthwhile ever is. So now you're spouting wisdom, hero boy? <laughs> Come on. Alright. There we go, chat. I'm ready to find the ice dragon now. I don't remember this going so fast. But yes, we're gonna take a quick break. Um, be back in a few minutes. I'll get words on stream for you guys. See if something to do while I'm gone. And if you've been sitting here this whole time too, make sure you get a stretch in yourself. Maybe some water or drink. Maybe even a snack. And yeah, I'll be right back, chat! Everything good, chat? I randomly got a blue doo, -doo, doo that my OBS disconnected. Odd. Can, uh, Twitch, can you still see me? <laughs> oh no! I can't say the word deems in my thing anymore. Let me redo my chat. Why did it do this? Tibbity feed. Let's see, let's see if it refreshes. There we go. Are we are we back, chat? Are we back? Everything look good now? I that was very weird. Everything was fine and then it wasn't fine. <laughs> that was very weird. Making sure my streak on we set. Yeah, make sure you guys stick around for for it, because it's gonna count this as a new stream, I think. I think. That was really weird. Hope nothing else is broken. Everything is breaking. Not on day two. Also, new day. Welcome back. Welcome back. Uh, welcome back, Brenda Glenn, as well. Then you went to bed earlier, right? Good morning. Good morning. Maybe I don't. I don't. I don't know. Hello, on Twitch. Everything's breaking. Is is it okay now, though? Is it okay? Also, everything okay on the YouTube side? Yeah, it's fine now? Okay. Never went to bed? What the heck? Oh, I guess you just have to go, uh, go for a little while, I see. Hello from YouTube, so YouTube's okay? Oh! Ah! Okay, good. Thank you, chat. That was very weird. Just out of nowhere. Just disconnect. Oh, and the ads! No! One second chat. Okay. 
Well, I guess later than I thought. Actually, I need to go to bed. See you later. Good night, Frank. on. Sleep well. It's not a sub with thumb without a bit of scalp. True. Very true. Alright. Let's go, chat. What was that camera angle? I would say this game... So far... Even though we've played most of it, I'm gonna say so far... Uh, has not really... Uh... What's the word? Stood up to my memories of it? It's still pretty good. But it's not as good as I remember. Stop backing up, you silly guy. Holy heck. Alright, so... Yeah, we were just there, so yeah, we go this way. Good night, Frangalon! Sleep well, sleep well! Come on, you worthless waste of flesh! Let's go! You gotta hop on steam oh, he's a big hat! Dragon. The crystal should be almost ready, and the volcano's right on the brink! He has a big hat, chat. Choo-choo! Come on, Sparks. We've got to catch them. What in the world? Find the three lovers and press circle to smack them into place. Whoa! Fire cannon. Whoa! So many explosions. Oh, do I need to turn that on? I'll just restart that. There we go. Turn that back on. Hopefully that's been working the whole time. Oops. Scuff here, scuff there, scuff everywhere, chat. Yeah. There's one done. And there's another one over there. No! Don't fall! Ah! What was that? What was that yell for? Spiral? You're officially a scuff VTuber. <laughs> no! We're on a platform, you know what that means? Ah, that's right. Alright, we got the third one. I assume the second one's right over here. Oh! Ow! I thought I got rid of the scuff! OBS was like, no. You must have scuff. I'm actively getting hit during this. Oh my goodness. How? Why? Why? Better not kill me. You don't know how to drive this thing. Uh, how hard can it be? It's on rails. Oi, famous last words. Hello, Lipshot. Welcome, welcome. Good to see you. Oh no. Oh no, not another tram. Not another tram. Oh. Caboose. Change the tilt, tack the steam and the caboose by ramming it or pressing triangle to shoot fire at it. Oh god, chat, what is this? Oh god. Oh god, oh god, I don't like this. I don't like this. Oh, garlic. 
Explosions, exactly. Arara! That's all my points. I hope it was worth it. Worth it? Heck yeah. Oh no! We're all out of magic! Keep smacking them. Oh, we get magic from that. Okay, nice. Oh, this is hurting my eyes a little bit. Seeing all these flashes. I could just ram them. It's gonna take a little bit though. That seems to do a little bit more damage. Ing also piss off the monkeys on the side so they stop throwing uh, uh, TNT at me. Oh! Uh... Now we're just on the steam? Meow! We go pass him! Uh oh! Okay, don't go in front of him now, Chad. Don't don't ever go in front of him. I see now. I see. Choo choo. That was crazy. Oh. Oof. Okay. Grab these, get our HP back up. Get down there. Buffalo beetle. They didn't they didn't name these uniquely. These are just called buffalo beetles. Wonder what the criteria was to get a unique name uh, character or monster. Woo! Back at it. Imagine we get to the last boss chat. It's on a cliff. We just eat her off. Looks like all the creatures had generic names, whereas the people had had them. True, true. Oh, had proper names. Yeah, that makes sense. Get back up here, you. So I can knock you down. Myself off. I better be a bit more careful. Yeah, we better be a bit more careful. For Dragon, he's real bad at flying upward. For dragon, he's just bad at flying. True. Hasn't used his wings in like he should have, so they're very weak. I would assume that's like the reason or something. It's very. It sounds very scientific. Just like how you don't use your legs for a while, so they get uh, they get very weak. Don't use your arms very much, they get weak. You don't use your brain very much, it gets weak. He's got weak wings, haha. <laughs> Atrophy, yes! Thank you, that's the word. Do 
to get atrophy. Oh, I think my dinner is here, chat. Potentially? I'd rather have a trophy. All right, chat, we're gonna pause right here. Oh God, not right there, not right there, not right there. Okay, not right there. Or maybe it's not here yet? Maybe it's not here yet? No, okay. Oh, it's okay, We. this is a good pausing point. This is a good pausing point. Let's save. Oh. All right. Oh, big stretch. Oh. Oh. All right, chat. If you guys haven't had any breaks or anything this whole time, you should take one. You should get some food. You should go get some, uh, like a stretch or even a rest, depending on what time it is for you. No, Sammy yet? It should be here any minute. I was told arrives between four or five forty-seven and five fifty-two, so should be here. Like it's already five fifty-two. It it should be here. Uh, hopefully, hopefully soon. I'm dying. My tummy is eating me. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna take a break. I'm gonna put on words on stream for you guys, and then we're gonna come back with some Dungeons and Dragons. I guess I guess I don't need to. Uh, Keep this on for now. And close this. But hopefully we can finish Spyro tonight. I don't think, I don't think we have too much left. Uh, we'll just have to see. But yeah, I will be back in a little bit. Let me get words on stream set up for you guys. And yeah, I'm gonna go eat some Dindin. I'll be back after dinner. What is that on the right of your face? Oh, this? This is the uh, menu for the festival! Oh, thank you for the follow! Is it Marquini? Thank you, thank you so much for the follow, I appreciate it! I'm gonna change my category to words on stream. Doo -doo -doo. On the left rest, yeah, this right, right, right here. This is the menu for the festival! It's all the events that we can do. We're also over here on the left side underneath the timer. Um, yeah, I forgot to, to hide it earlier. <laughs> yeah, there's all, all the, the information for it. Also, welcome in Cyrus. I think you were here earlier. Dragon Day at the Fox Festival Spyro. And now D&D, true, true. I, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, in the cup, there's something. In the cup, there's something. In the cup? In the cup? Me? I'm in the cup. I'm the only thing in the cup. <laughs> I'm the only thing in the cup! See? <laughs> uh, but yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna go eat dinner. I'll be back in a little bit, chat. Yeah, we hope anyway. So be right back, chat. See you guys in a little bit for D and D, and maybe finishing the game. So pause the timer. Nine thirty-two. We're at nine thirty-two, chat. So be right back here in a little while after I get back. Okay. Okay. We are back.
Hello, Chad. I am back. I am back. Hello. You had the right. You had the right thing. I guess I was just finishing up uh, talking to the group, setting up my stuff for this. Yes, I am back. I'm back. I'm back. Let me change my category. Oh, I hope y'all had a good time with words on stream. I had a good dinner. Had me a good sub sandwich. Oh, I was so ready for that sandwich. It was yummy. Let's see. Dungeons and dragons. Yes. Bread coma now? Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. I'm feeling, feeling pretty good. I, I was very hungry. I was very hungry. Also, thank you for the hydrate. Hope you all had a good time with the words on stream. Sorry I left you alone for so long. Hope everything went well. I see I dropped some frames while uh, we were gone. Hopefully it wasn't too bad. Let's see, let's see. Check everything real quick. Oh uh, yeah, I think everything's looking good. Everything looking good on chat's end. And then if so, we can go... Uh... Join the DNT group. I think everything's looking good on my end. Chat, by the way, you guys are super lucky. Here, wait, okay. We all good? We all good? We finished fire? Uh, not quite, not quite. I took a break on the last level. We're trying to get the last dragon. Uh, what is it? Ter ter Terador or something like that? Uh, we're trying to rescue him, so I had to go break for dinner. And so we're still on that last level. I assume we have to help him and then we have to get to the get to Cinder. So we have a little bit left, but probably not a whole lot. But uh, on Tuesday evenings, I do D&D, so we're going to be doing a D&D session tonight. Sarahs! Thank you so much for the resub! Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Alright, let's get into the game chat. Oh wait, I, sh I should probably do this. Uh, I could use my Foogie now. I could use Foogie. Foogie, Foogie, Foogie. Login with Discord. B? Where's a B? There's no B. Unless you mean hog. Do, do, do. I kind of want to put my music in here. One second, chat. I'm going to put my music back here. I have hog B is the cute one. Alright, let's see, let's see. Here we go. Do, 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 do. All right, and here we go, chat. Mm. Um, I think they're actually not, you're not actually popping up on my side anymore. Let me, maybe it's this one? Maybe it's this one? Uh... <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> alright, alright. They, they can hear you now. Chat, let me let me know how the audio is. Although other people have those are Mars, welcome back. Yes, we're doing DD tonight. Doing our D D session for the week. Right, there we go, there we go. Okay. I didn't like that the, the things were
Womp 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 womp. Hello, have in! Welcome in, welcome in! Hi, Huda! A little quiet. Okay. Do do do. I mean, that's the best use of your Twitch time if you only come to watch Griffin. Oh, heck. Jumpada, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in. <laughs> no, they were banned from saying Fortnite. True. True, true, true.
somehow middling. So. <laughs> I gotta... apologize for my friend here. Not very easy to impress this one. Not easy. And you see, uh, he looks into the building and cocks his head. And you see that he looks over at Maggie and points at you and, like, looks back at her. And he whispers over to, uh, to his other friend that's standing in front of you. Mm, what's that? Uh, I've been told to show you the side entrance. And, uh, something interesting here. Maggie's Books and Orb Emporium is in the middle of kind of a row of buildings. There's no real side entrance, but you see that this goblin walks up to the seam between buildings and, uh, holds out a hand towards you. Uh, I'll, I'll take a hand. And you see he uh, flicks his head down, getting sunglasses right in front, and just says, all right, let's go. And he, you see he pushes into the wall, and it's almost as if his body is going flat as he pushes between this minuscule crevice between the buildings. Uh, you do feel this kind of magic as you take his hand you do feel this magic barrier kind of envelop your body uh and he starts squeezing through his hand meets the seam and just pulls right through uh and with it your hand so you're kind of being pulled into the center of these two buildings as you're kind of inching along this wall And, uh, you finally make your way to a door. All right, uh, here is our stop. He opens the door and holds a flattened hand towards it, just to, like, gesture right this way. I just take a look around, I'm like, I do like secret passages, and I'll follow along. Uh, you find that your first encounter with the store, there was a side room where the goblins went when they were unionizing. <laughs> <laughs> this, is a, this is a callback and a half. Uh, the goblins, uh, <laughs> the goblins were like in their own secret room where they were doing their various little magics, enchanting orbs and books. Uh, the side room seems to be still intact, despite the rest of the building being renovated to match this new aesthetic. And you can faintly hear through the wall, uh, Maggie just kind of discussing with these seemingly very important visitors, if they've managed to block off the whole store. Uh, you, see, you hear her pacing. Uh, she's like right on the other side of the wall. I just... I. I just wish there was a little bit more of a warning just so that I can make sure everything was dusted. Well, we figured you'd have plenty of resources to have. And he looks over to the... You can almost hear him looking at the goblins outside. And people for that. That being said, I'm very impressed with the inventory you've managed to accumulate. Uh, has this resulted in the shift we anticipated uh yeah people are spending more for the same things and we certainly have richer clientele but i then this is a success i whatever you say so impress me what? You have all these wares of magical variety. I wish to be impressed. I see orbs that have mountainous scenes flowing through them and shifting terrains and 
Books of unknown origin, some of which questionable. But I wish to be impressed. Well, um, we have some, and you kind of hear a floundering for an answer here. Have you made no improvement to your wares whatsoever? No, we've absolutely made improvements to the wares, but I don't know how to explain this to you any further. We sell books. We sell orbs. Like, there's only so much I can innovate there. Like, have you considered prisms? I, I, that seems like a step back from orbs, or at least like a like a more of a, more of a side step, if anything. This seems. I don't. Here. And, uh, she. <laughs> you hear her pulling a book from the wall directly in front of you? A book. Open it. Ooh! An orb inside! Yep. It's a book orb. It's a orb with a book, or a book with an orb. I feel like this falls more into book with an orb then it's a book with an orb all right how much 1500 gold sounds like a deal to me all all right then uh right this way and you are getting a message from maggie uh she's casting message and it just says, kill me. <laughs> it just says, I'm over this. I don't know what, I don't know what we could further do to like, I just can't make them happy. And, uh, <laughs> you hear mass, you hear bags upon bags of coins hitting the counter. Does that sound about right? That's three bags. Is there 500 in each? I think so. All right. Yeah, that's good. These are massive. These are way too big. Uh, but I will do what I can to further improve the store. I'll look into Maggie's Books and Orbs and Prisms Emporium. That is all I ask. Thank you. I'm going to be in town for a couple more days. I may stop by again, and please don't rent out the entire store. I, I've been building the new clientele, and it just makes it more difficult. No promises. And uh, the front door swings open and closes, and she steps into the back room. I'm over it. I'm over it. I'm over it. I'm over it. We gotta do something. Seems like a nice fella. No. No. <laughs> no. Don't do that. Oh. oh, come on, Maggie. Look at all that. Uh. Money? Money? <laughs> this is like. Okay, so. Gold to elves is like copper to us. Apparently, he's of some elven nobility. Charging platinum. They don't, they don't, they just have gold and more gold. They don't really do the whole platinum thing. I don't get it either. They have old, they have old gold coins that are worth more, but that's about it. <sighs> How busy are you? I want to unrenovate. Unrenovate? 
I'm fi I'm I'm fixing destroying this place. Are you with me? Uh -huh. I'm going back to the basic world of books and loops. Back to square one. Oh, uh, here it is. Uh, you, you don't have to sell me any further than demolition. That sounds like a good time. Used to be a simpler time. She cracks her neck, cracks her neck. Sticks her, steps outside, sticks her head out the front door. Everyone, we are closed for the night. Uh, feel free to return again tomorrow. Uh, where's will be the same. A bit different presentation. Lads, and you see all the goblins just turn to attention. We got some wrecking to do. And you see all of them just kind of reach behind their backs in unison and put on hard hats. And they just, <laughs> like, they just single file pile into the building. Uh, let's see, I want a cup. I, was, I just want a few rolls here and we'll return to the results of what ensues. Let me see. Uh, let me check something real quick. Okay. Give me a combination... Or, not a combination. Give me one sleight of hand. One arcana. And one survival check. Um, one side of van, one arcana, one survival. Okay. Are any of their names Ralph? I must know. You know what? I'll have that. I, I named the second one Frankie. I'll name the one that just kind of has the very matter of fact voice. That's Ralph. That's Ralph. He's gonna wreck it, right? Oh, he's for sure gonna wreck it. <laughs> um, that's his whole deal. He was very excited. <laughs> that's why he, he got put on bodyguard detail, and he's like, "I can wreck it here." And then she's like, "Demolition time," and he's just like, "This is the best job ever." He's he's the one that reminded all of them to have their hard hats on hand. Exactly. He was just like, "We never know." Uh, the opportunity may Anna. always arise to wreck. You must be ready. Uh, that one's plus. It was Arcana, Sight of Hannah. What was the... Uh, the last the one, one was... The last one was... Survival. Survival. Uh I have to survive this demolition. I have. Right. <laughs> I definitely not surviving this. Okay. So, um, with help from your magic. Primarily, you manage to uh, kind of help shift things back. Like, you're mainly using your magic for uh, moving things from point A to point B, kind of using that astral magic. Uh, very solid, like, feng shui going on right now. And as you're progressing, it starts to look more and more like that original store you came to know and love. I, I, you just... Just burn it down a little bit. I mean, I just do have... Just burning at little. hands is one of my... Uh, one of my spells right now. There is a bunch of use... Like, these... There are a bunch of overly bougie shelves that were immediately requested by the new owners. And she's just like, these are too much. Give me an excuse to burn them. I will. Torch him. Ralph, 
Can you make, uh, can you build some shelving off of the remains of these? Like, just give it a nice, give it a nice torch. It's a little too clean for me. And, uh, Ralph is like, I think we could do something. So, uh, one construction montage later, uh, we leave that scene for now. I will continue it in the morning, but, uh, we cut over to Trayel. You said you were going to the bar. Correct. All right. So you are at the bar having a, uh, after the day that has happened and the adventure you've been on and combination of all the real life Thaddeus things and the trail journey that's happened uh you're just like i just need i just need something strong so you go to the bar and you get the hookup uh i don't know if i ever gave the blonde like the original blonde barkeep a name let's go with nora uh yeah i don't know nora sees you coming up and she's like you have seen better days and she reaches under the counter uh just kind of reaches to a shelf behind her without even looking uh grabs a pristine looking bottle of scotch and just pops the cork pours that in and slides it your way Appreciate it. This one's on the house, sugar. You you are looking rough, my friend. I've had us working back to back gigs. Not the best time. Well, hopefully you get at least a night of nothing strange or uh over the top hap and as she says happening, the front door of the guild hall swings open. And in walks your friend Diego. Uh, he usually has a particular posture to him. Someone that's constantly got their head on a swivel. Ready to draw daggers at a moment's notice. Uh, he seems weirdly unbothered right now. For a former syndicate member uh, in the guild hall. And give me a perception check really quick. I. Oof. Ten. Even with a ten, an inherent behavior of his that he's been trying to, like, burn into your brain for years he doesn't do he approaches the bar he does not once check the corners behind him he always does a double take over his shoulders just to be sure this time around mm. he is completely unfazed he sits at the bar I could really use a drink right now and he uh, holds a hand out and she goes for a glass similar to yours and uh he holds his hand up uh no just just a nail is fine and she puts the glass back goes for a uh flagon and begins to get that ready is he sitting next to me uh you are taking like the far seat on a corner he is taking the seat on the other side of that corner like okay okay yeah so... uh you look like you have been on quite a journey my friend it's you could say that well Seems like you need uh, just a moment to unwind. And uh, looks like you're enjoying your drink. Looks like you're enjoying your drink. And I uh, am. so if we're at the, the like corners, mm -hmm. 
Um, I'm going to be using one hand to be drinking, and with my other hand, I'm I'm slowly pulling the uh, Han Solo in in Episode One or Episode A New Hope. Slowly I... reaching down for my gun. I just got back from uh, what is formerly known as uh, Syndicate City, uh, now known as the Heavenloft. It was quite a journey, but managed to get there just fine with... Uh, managed to get there just fine via the guild teleportation, but I decided to take the journey back to Panda. What did you wonder, my friend? Why are we here? Well, things were not perfect back there, but... I do feel like things have changed for the better. I think there is hope for us there. Maybe not in the way you and I are used to, and he takes a big swig of his flag in a veil. Uh, and you feel like you see something uh, on his wrist. Something. But he puts down the flag in and kind of turns that hand back facing his body. I just think that if what we are after were still around, maybe things here wouldn't be quite as, um, fast, you say. I think this recent addition of all of these mercenaries from other kingdoms kind of goes away in the original direction that the particular leader of this particular faction were uh, believing. I think my journey here may be coming to an end, but there is always hope for a new purpose. And he takes another swig of his ale. Mm -hmm. uh, give well, me, give me a. You never know what the future brings. Give me a quick investigation. This is related to your larger task, so I will give you advantage on it. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got a 10. We got an 11, baby. <laughs> That's what advantage is all about. Hold on. What was my... I'm slowly working my way up to decent rolls. Yep. Progress. They have really done something with the development of... Uh, the... Uh, Heaven's Loft. Turning what was once a... Last stronghold to a new bastion of hope. And all you must do is believe. Hmm. Well, I've heard such things before. And uh, you remember a previous conversation where he was mentioning... Uh, one of your former syndicate mates uh, converting over to whatever is happening over there. There was some kind of holy man that seemed to be growing a following. Maybe Victor was onto something. Perhaps. I think that may, may be my true calling. I've... Sort of my purpose here. If you wish to pursue this well, then I 
cannot change your mind, but... There may yet be hope for you. All we have to do is... Drop what we're doing here. There they have safety. Comfort. A shelter to withstand the coming storm. Perhaps, perhaps. Would you be uh, making your way back down there any time soon? I may rest for the night, but... I think I may make my way down there tomorrow. He's been cultified. Oh, yeah, yeah, he has. <laughs> He's joined the cult. That's straight up why I'm sitting. That's why I'm sitting there with my gun ready to fucking shoot him under the table. Uh, you see, he kind of closes his eyes uh, in thought for a moment, and you see he like barely peeks them open, but. What were previously blue eyes have been replaced by this kind of eerie orange glow for a brief moment. And he blinks and it's gone. I can see you have doubts. Hmm. I do. I think any man would be a skeptic. Sorry, you were uh, cutting out there for a moment. Uh-oh. <clears throat> I think any man would be a skeptic. I, too, uh, went in with logic in heart, but you would be amazed what a little persuasion could do. And uh, it's at that moment you feel just a slight poke at your leg. Uh, I go... I, I give a quick glance down to see. I got a boner. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Arnor. Arnor. That's, that's horrible. Uh, <laughs> man, it's crazy what hope for the future does to a man. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, you... Look down and you see what was once a plain iron dagger. Uh, he made a point to always notch a tally in for each kill. These blades used to be adorned with tallies. Mm -hmm. uh, now a ceremonial dagger pointed at your leg. It's not drawing blood, but it is resting there. He's He's been made blissfully... Uh, aware of the weapon that you've had drawn and just has a secondary precaution. Uh, if you were to kind of look at his intentions right now, uh, you've known this guy long enough to be able to read him and like what seems off. Mm -hmm. He always has the same look in his eye when he is about to go for a kill that is absent <clears throat> well I hope that you find what you need as I have found what I need and he pulls the dagger away holsters it stands up finishes his ale you see plain as day uh, glowing on his wrist is an orange sigil of an eye. He places that down. I pray that you survive the coming storm, my friend. Andy, gives you a... I just raise nod. my glass to him as he leaves. Gives a curt nod and walks out. You could tell there was like in his speech the way he communicated with you 
there was an air of Diego that was still there, but not everything is the same with him. There is something oh, that is yeah. significantly shifted, but you can tell that the memories he has life. of you, the memories he has of you it's still are him. intact. It's still him. He's just been cultified. Yep. Uh, and I believe there was one more... Mimi, you left the building with your slimes, but you meant to go to the sandwich shop, and we never resolved that. I was going to go to the sandwich shop, yes. All right. Uh, you head over to the sandwich shop. Uh, you see there, there is a massive line out the door. Uh... You know this place usually gets a solid line going, but this is, like, wrapped around many times over, and people look frustrated. They are... They are just, like, rubbing their temples. People are just like, we could just go somewhere else. And someone's just like, no, you really do have to try this sandwich. Like, th there's something... I can't describe it, but... I feel like this is one of the hidden gems of Guild City. All right. Well, we'll stay in line. How long have we been here? And uh, you see the other one looks up. Well, that's the moon. In the distance at least it's not night night but it's it's getting there all right well there's a bakery it's open late worst case scenario we go there and just get some bread uh, but you knowing that you have this kind of special privilege of having that in at this sandwich shop uh you're just like, oh, let me just walk in and see what's going on. And people do recognize you at this point. They're just like, oh, yeah, that's that's the girl that has the sandwich wagon. Yeah, my sandwich wagon. Uh, that's Miss Sandwich. That's, <laughs> you don't understand. That's Miss Sandwich. You created sandwiches. Get sandwiched, uh, get sandwiched. She invented uh, the sandwich. That... The dryads are all in the back. What usually is kind of allocated to bringing the sandwiches out to people, everyone is in the kitchen cooking right now. And there is one girl sitting in there. Uh, she has a notepad. Uh, she has like these goggles. Uh, like potentially mid to late teenager. And she's just sitting there. Ooh. She has a sandwich brought out to her. Piles that one in. Just like destroys this sandwich. Okay. Um, one more. And you see that she puts a tally on her page. And she's like working something out. And you see the guy at the register is just like negotiating with a customer that's just like do we really have to put everything into feeding this one person? And the guy at the register is just like, I don't I don't know if you get it. She we're making the materials for the sandwich as fast will, as she can eat them. I don't I know what's going on. There's this one girl and you see he looks up at you. What a day for you to come. Uh I'd love to make you something, but she's eaten our entire stock. You see, there's nothing abnormal about this girl, but she is just like destroying these sandwiches. Hmm. That in itself sounds abnormal. 
and uh, the dryad walks out from the kitchen. Okay, this is this is the biggest one we can make with the materials we have right now. But if you just wait a couple of minutes, pass. And she eats the sandwich and just hmm. Okay, one more. And the dryad is just like, look, you've been here for hours. I don't know how you're doing this. I don't know why you're doing this, but have you seen the line? And she's just like, what I'm seeing is, this data is inconclusive. And she looks at her notebook for a moment. And you see that she has this, uh, she reaches into her jacket and pulls out this small vial and pops the cork, gives it a swirl. Uh, it's this semi-viscous purple drink, and she takes a swig of it, wipes any remaining from her lips, and there's a particular pulse in her eyes when this happens, like this faint pastel pink pulse in her pupils. And... Mm. Hmm. Uh, she just looks up at you and cocks her head. Hold off on that sandwich. And the whole, the whole kitchen just sighs of relief. <laughs> you come here and you see that the guy at the register finally starts taking another order better hurry and uh she just kind of points at you snaps points at the table have a seat me y yes you the standout person here the rest of these Whatever. You. Yes. Table. Please. Now. Okay. I suppose... So. Sorry, you were saying? I don't like the cut of your jib so far, lady. Well, I don't like the appetite that this potion has given me, but... Then stop drinking it! <laughs> I just want to see what the upper limits of a Mimic's appetite are. And so far, nothing is working. You're eating the wrong things. Sandwiches don't do it. So, I just wanted to know, and she pulls down her goggles, <laughs> and you see that, like, she has these lenses that click out and kind of telescope out. She takes a closer look at you. How do you do it? Very easily. You're not a very good mimic. Hmm. Well, I mean, I spotted you, so there's that. Is it just restraint? Like, what do we... Also, I'm not a mimic. So there's that. Um, this potion right here, and she pulls the bottle out and sets it on the table. Uh, just kind of gives me like the second she sets it on the table, I'm it. gonna eat it. Oh, Looking no, 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 straight into one. her eyes. <laughs> <laughs> that won't do. And she pulls a pocket watch from her jacket. Pushes I'm gonna a eat it. <laughs> and you're going for her hand. The pocket watch, yeah. <laughs> Staring directly into her eyes. <laughs> she clicks the button as you approach, no. and time rewinds. Uh, you've just been asked to sit at the table. She asks you how you handle your appetite. Yeah, so there's this, like, potion that I'm having. I'm gonna uh, eat the table. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, you are easy to spot. That... Wow. Eat the lady. Right on the money. Um, and you see she, like, catches her notebook as you, like, eat the full table. Okay, I want to so slide a hand a notebook. Uh, slide a mouth, mouth the notebook. 
Sure, go for it. <laughs> eater, Griff, eater. Oh god, uh... I feel like I had a sleight of mouth roll. <laughs> yeah, it sounds I, about right. I imagine it's the same as whatever you would add to your attack. Because it, it's probably just stat plus proficiency. Stat plus proficiency? You already have sleight of hand, yeah, so it yeah, should whatever... be much pain. Whatever stat you use to calculate your mouth attack. It was like, yeah, it was like a mouth roll or something. I think it'd be. Oh, mouth mod. Uh, hold on, yeah. scroll back down. It's like one d twenty plus dex plus. Yeah, that that'd be the same as my sleight of hand. It's dex plus proficiency. Mm -hmm. Yep. So yeah. Sleight I... of hand equals sleight of mouth. I, I rolled a d twenty for luck, so I'm gonna roll really bad here. But hey, that means you can add a d6 to it if you want. Okay. Oh yeah, didn't we also like whenever we get a roll uh, a nat twenty for luck? Doesn't the second person also get like a one d6 yeah. for whatever? Uh, I don't know who that was. I don't, uh, I don't think it got uh, brought up. I rolled a seventeen. Yeah, that was Jerry. So uh, give me a d6. Hey! Oh, nice. Massive. Yeah, okay. I rolled an 18. Uh, you snatch the notebook from her. Uh, and eat it. And eat it. Uh, her eyes widen. Staring directly into her eyes as I do. Years of research. And, uh, you see, she just stands up, uh, her goggles, she puts them back on top of her head, she looks That's at you. That's dangerous. You're gonna regret this. And she walks out of the building. No, you! That's where she shouldn't have fucked with the sandwich man. Exactly. This is my oh, sandwich no. shop. She's in my territory. <laughs> my domain. She, she's not even a real mimic. Domain exactly. expansion. Sandwich, sandwich shop, shop of eternity. <laughs> <laughs> domain expansion. Eternal deli. Mimi doesn't deal deli. with her problems. She eats them. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> oh, man. How do I satiate my appetite by eating no problems? So, uh, she just says, you'll regret this, and walks out. I wonder uh, what, what nice things I'll get to read in that journal later. Yeah. Make mimics are despicable little creatures who will eat your research. <laughs> Scoundrels. All of them. Uh, the dryads see you sitting at what used to be uh, a table. Oh, right. Uh, now that she's gone, I'm gonna try to fish it back out. Uh -huh. <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. You fish the table back out, and you put it back in place. It's I, a I bit... Just wipe a it bit off wet. a little bit. Yeah, I, okay. I, I just wipe, wipe it off a little bit. Um... It is new, right? They don't have to buy a new table. Fire Dryad walks over, looks at the table, looks at you. I'm just happy it's for you this time, and puts a sandwich down. Oh, thank God. Uh, the hook up with a double decker. Exactly what I came here for. Mm hmm. Uh, don't, don't worry, you guys are safe. As long as you you feed me, you know what? No one's, <laughs> the no day one's gonna you step on my territory. Sandwich shop. Sounds like a deal to me. And uh, they walk off. Uh, I think you have some kind of portal access to their sandwich reserve. Oh, that's right. I forgot. For about the time that. being, uh, it has been depleted by a by a mimic. <laughs> But, uh, uh -oh. 
Not a real mimic. Well, no. a sandwich mimic is mimic. <laughs> a, a, a copycat mimic. <laughs> a mimic mimic. Mimicant. <laughs> oh my god, a mimic. Where did her stomach go to is the question. Mimic? Can you mimic a mimic mimic? <laughs> uh, the question of where her stomach leads. Uh, somewhere in the astral plane, a small rift opens and sandwiches begin to pour out of it into the river of souls. <laughs> <laughs> splash, the next splash, question splash, we go to the astral splash. plane to get back to get back those sandwich ingredients. Man, all that waste. Uh, I think with that, everyone kind of did their thing for the night. Uh, Crom helped out with making a believable-looking crash site. Hauled off the dragon glass and uh, was there any last minute add ons? Did anyone want to swing anything else in? No, okay. I mean, um, I mean, Maze uh, reads her tarot. Uh, that's a uh, sure, that's about it. I, I, I pulled actual tarot cards. Do it. She's she's ready for the the. Um, I will say the I expedition. Had, I I had one logistical question occur to me just now. Huh. How so? So Mimi is a mimic, and you like as a living creature, you still need to like actually eat some stuff to sustain yourself, right? Yep. Yeah. How do you distinguish between? Like, food and so so your closet is your stomach but like so d does some stuff is some stuff getting digested in the closet like how does that work okay uh, there's so a... uh <laughs> i think we worked this out at one point weirdly enough we did work it out okay so you would think that the there's a light in the middle of the ceiling in a room right uh-huh so where you think that light would be there's a hole and that hole leads to my mouth so the things uh -huh. that I eat fall down that hole. And uh -huh. underneath that hole, there is this thing that kind of looks like an outside fire pit. It's it's round and it looks kind of burked up right. in, in a circular shape. That's where the stuff falls in. And every now and then I have to go clean it out because I don't want to digest my treasure. It slowly mm -hmm. digests things in there. So I I have to go clean the treasure out of it. Uh, uh, and and clean it from you know the the more um, edible things that I've eaten that that also end up there. Yeah, I remember we did talk about that, but it's been a while. So that's how that works. That's why sometimes yeah, I, I need to go. I need to go look at my treasure and. It's been a while since you ate maize. So. <laughs> it's been a while since you ate maize. <laughs> And we had to pull her out <laughs> via rope so she didn't get grabbed. You know, standard standard antics. Yeah, um, you know. Uh, quick question that I just don't know off the top of my head. Uh, Hellish Rebuke. How often does that refresh? Daily. Okay. Well, like the the tiefling version, like yeah, long tiefling, rest, tiefling yeah. version, tiefling version. Yeah, that's that's a, that's a long rest. You get, you get one per long rest. Okay, perfect. That's two what I thought. Thank you. So, uh, it's only two. Yeah, uh, you can get it at higher levels, but the base is two d ten. The night I'm too much is this game kind of wank. Oh, uh, what did Maze's tarot uh, end up? Uh, I got a I got a seven of swords in the past, eight of pentacles in the present, and the reversed fool in the future. Okay, so um, seven of swords in the past. Funnily enough, seven of swords was one of the cards that Rainer initially pulled for your journey back in session two. Was it actually? Yes. <laughs> I'm not oh, even kidding. Uh, what, was, what was current? What was current? Uh, eight of pentacles. Pentacles. I prefer the eight of tentacles, but you know. 
Hey, yo! <laughs> Card indicates a time that you have to work hard and focus entirely on your tasks. Mm -hmm. It's not entirely a negative situation, but this means you must really strive to be the best. How? And, and then the, the reversed fool. Reversed fool. Which, uh, I, I looked at a couple of, of things for this one, but I feel like this one uh, very much fits. I'll send you. Let's see. Reversed fool. Damn. Okay. Yeah, no, that checks. Yep. Okay. I, I love I love how Mimi is a bard, but it's done very little. <laughs> that would that like if you but if you like pay attention to the things that happened, you would never know. Yeah, I haven't. Like, ha she, like, like, like you have a class, but you're just a mimic. Thing. She hasn't done much bard thing since that first village. Yeah. Yeah, you know, whenever I, I almost led the mayor to his death, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was... Yeah, I'm, I'm about to say, she oh. she's a bard, but she's mostly a mimic. Yeah, yeah I, I'm a mimic class with, with a bard rogue background. There you go. <laughs> Essentially, yeah. I eat things. When when she does bardic things, the the ick is from mimic. It's bardic. Oh no! Oh god! Yeah, sometimes so, I have to like seduce things with my pretty voice and my awesome guitar skills. True. Oh, for sure. <laughs> and and unironically, bardic inspiration has been super helpful. And for sure. So, so sometimes you have to do part. that. That's that. That's only if the eating doesn't, you know, work the first time. Mm -hmm. What can I say? Mimi's pretty plucky and pretty lucky. True. And and the rogue part is really helpful for enhancing my mimic uh, natural talents. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So the night comes and everyone's uh, resting. Maze, you're resting in. Uh, you decided to kind of like stay over and wrap some last minute stuff up in the morning with uh, Maggie's books and orbs, no longer Emporium. Uh, that being said, we cut to Goob, who is sitting at the top of the guild hall. Just kind of like staring off in the direction that the dragon fire came from. And kind of lost in thought. Just wondering like how much they're helping by being here and how much they're just making this place a target. To dare take my lead away. Uh, Goob does have a voice mod voice. Uh, let me get that going. The end of Goob. You take my Goob away. I mean, it can't entirely be my fault. I. I never wanted any of that to happen. I just... Look. We're fine. We were made for one thing. We're doing another. We're fine. No one here has any problems. We're fine. himself, uh, he looks back at the crash site. Wait, no, if I'm remembering the angle... Why are they so close? And... you wake up. In which world? Insomnia. Oh. 
at least you all wake up in the middle of the dining hall. It's empty right now. Uh, this isn't what I went to bed. It's oddly quiet. Usually there's some kind of staff around into the night just to take care of any travelers that arrive at a less than convenient hour, but... It's, like, completely silent? Entirely. Can I kick over a chair? Your foot goes right through the chair. Son of a bitch. Can I hear Arya say that? Was it all of us there, or can we see each other? You can see each other. Okay. Can I hear Arya when Arya's like, son of a bitch? Yep. Okay. You can all hear each other. This shit again. The, the moment oh, my great. the moment my foot goes through it, I just pull, I just like get heated up. All right. Uh. There's something off about this room. The floor is intact. The walls are well, seemingly at this point intact, but something's off for sure. Because, you know, illusory chair. I, uh, I activate. Can I... Sorry, um, go ahead. Can I detect magic? This place reeks of magic. Um, what kind? It says I can sense a faint aura around. Yeah, did you anything get... that bears it? It just lights up. You see a. You guys kind of ended up in the center of the room. There's a balcony. Uh, you see a single wisp up there. Uh -huh. But what kind of magic is it? Yeah, because it should say for like what school of magic it's from for detect magic, right? Mm -hmm. um, I'm going so. to say illusion. Makes As sense. expected. I'm just gonna kind of like put my finger to my lip and point up at it. I wanna wanna activate the glow on my eggs and see if I can't like. Focus it into a beam flashlight style and point it at what Crumb is pointing at. Uh, you turn on your uh, godly light on your weapon, and seemingly the illusory furniture in your immediate vicinity kind of the portion of it that is in the light within like a certain radius just disappears mm -hmm. you focus it towards the point that crumb is aiming at and the wisp uh relocates to the bottom of the stairs interesting i'll follow it uh crumb are you just kind of like tracing where this orb is yeah Uh, you follow it, and for a brief moment, at the bottom of the stairs, you see a cloaked figure. When the when the beam hits the wisp, essentially, you see a cloaked figure. You just kind of a crooked head is looking at you. Do I do I recognize this man? You've seen him once before, and he is responsible for the fascinating ink on your left arm after a unfortunate encounter. Uh, in the hive. Oh. Crumb's just gonna be like, who the fuck is that? You are 
are certainly quick to see through illusions. I call him a bitch in Viking. single snap and the room begins to peel away like unfolding from the top center there is a black void uh, beyond the room and as it unfolds and goes down the walls and gets to the floor as those pieces begin to peel away, uh, there is a white rectangle. Like, are we on the white rectangle or the yep, white just rectangle? A, like, just a white weird. floor, just a white rectangular floor in a black void. Mm. I'll like retract the light so that it's just like, like a glowing light around us now. Tell you what, if you want to free the fallen god of fortune, I'm here right now, and he pulls back the hood of his cloak. Give it your best shot. Underneath, there is a black fog rolling from what could only be described as a animated corpse of a human. Half of his face sloughed off from previous encounters with either defiant troops, those who oppose him, but this black fog emanates from his body and he extends outward a sword in the shape of a grandfather clock hand. Ari just gives a look to Crumb, like... Each of you get one free shot. I don't suggest you waste it. And he drops the blade, it rattles against the floor and disappears. He extends his hands outward, Standing there for a free shot. Arya just looks at Crumbs like, well. And, uh. What the fuck is that? Is gonna, is, is gonna pull send. Alright. How far away? Give me some attack rolls. Uh, I'd say he's about 30 feet away from you. Cool. Y'all are kind of like center of the room. He's like right at the outer edge. Cool, that'll give me my free one then. Okay. okay. Outer edge, you say? Yep, outer edge. How big is he? Uh, he is like... He appears to be slightly larger than your average human. Second. Like... But I think that's mainly just due to the bellowing fog from this cloak kind of lifting it. Uh, if anything, he's average human size. Okay. So, like, maybe... Maybe, like... Cool. 5'10", 6 foot. He is floating. Notably. Yes. Okay. But, I'm if you were to... Like... Uh, he's just levitating off the ground slightly, like walking, probably... walking too much effort. Do I still have uh, the prototypes, or were those broken? Uh, I believe those were broken in the last fight, but I will allow you to do damage this turn as if you had them. Cool. It's mostly just to add the charges, the D two and charges. Yeah, go for it. Swing. That'll hit. 
attack and swing. Ooh. Oof. That won't, and something is actually going to happen here. So roll damage for the first hit. Uh, what's the fire damage again? Uh, let's see. I believe it. Unless was... you want me to just full fist fighter it, like I like for this fight. Yeah, for this fight, full fist fighter it. Go. Cool. Uh, are you like you're melee attacking him, right? I, I, if that was the case, I would charge in with you. Okay. Uh, you can roll your attacks as well. Uh, all of you can just kind of like, I want to throw your attacks out. Uh, I, that used to say, I just want to be close to Arya. I'll go, like, I want to see how Arya's stuff resolves before I roll anything. And then, what charges do I have? I know I used. All of my gunpowder charges. I think I have two wood charges left. And I definitely don't have my magic charges anymore, so I only have two charges left. So let me get rid of these real quick. Okay. Uh, and I'll use one of the wood charges. Did you have to get close to him to hit him? Or is everybody still at range? Uh, they I got, got close. close. They're melee. Okay. Yeah. First hit. If it actually rolled correctly, it would have. So never mind. Give me a second. One D. One D. Plus one D. Plus one D. <laughs> Is that roll? Is this roll like record this time? Oh, plus that rolled it correct. There you go. There we go. Okay. Now about that net one. I do still have a couple more hits. Sure, I'll, I'll call the I'll call the nat one the last hit in your little combo here. Feel free to roll for more. Cool. Second. Okay, so that 19 is a crit. Okay. You love to see it. Plus. And then this one. But 29 will hit, and that will crit but the other two do not connect. One second. For sure. And that's the last hit. Yep, that will also hit. Okay. Okay. So then... Was that meant to be an 18 or an 8? 8. So, 19. Okay. That will not hit. Okay. Okay. So then the, the crit hits. So you get your first hit in. You feel a solid crack against his body. Uh, you get an idea of where he is. This allows you to line up a perfect strike. Roll that crit damage. I use another charge. Uh, I'm make that one a kick.
Paint, and then also do a liver punch with just a 16 con save. Okay. Yeah. That times two, so 44. Rolling like ass, rolling like ass. Uh, he does meet that con save. Damn. Considering how skeletal he felt on that first punch, it's bizarre, but... Uh, you... First hit, second hit, you manage to get like a... You manage to kind of faint out a haymaker into an elbow directly to the head. Uh, you feel his jaw disconnect from his body. Uh, and you go in for some follow-ups knowing that he would be dazed and as you go for a punch you are frozen in your tracks uh, before you what was once your enemy has been replaced by a long forgotten demon of insomnia mm. Tiamat sits oh. before you raises her wings and to those watching Arya you see her freeze in place momentarily and she is flung backwards you are grabbing to the edge of this white rectangle you manage to just barely catch yourself and you're now pulling yourself up back to the surface uh to everyone else he has not moved at all uh -huh. sorry is the only one that's on really? that. sorry jokes on you you throw me off i can fly bitch i got wings does that mean that there's nobody near him anymore or there's still melee fighters near him I'm, I'm still going. This is Lauren is approaching. Lauren's still approached, okay. Like, if you want to send it, I'll be fine, I'm sure. Oh, come now. You're so brazen in your expeditions. I'm right here. Uh. Alright. So, so to to reiterate, the little like transformation into the push. Arya was the only one that saw that. Actually, no, Maze. As this punch goes to connect, you see a flash of a massive black dragon hovering over the void, and these massive wings just flap and push solely Arya back. And just as fast as she appeared, she disappears. Do you like that sometimes? Does it obviously come from like my left eye with the dragon eye? Yes. Um, it is mm. clearly draconic vision. Okay. Uh, going I guess I have to get a dragon ear next, and then I can hear a dragon ear. Dragon ear. <laughs> does Maze like relay this information at all, or like does Arya? When Arya points stuff, I'm just like, "Yep, that's uh, Tiamat." Okay. <laughs> and you see. Uh, Fate looks over his shoulder behind him. Yeah, she's just like, that's Tiamat. Fuck. Tima? Tiamat? Tima? Tina? Tima? Timu? We're afraid of the Tima? Watch out. If 
Tiamat kind of sucks. It's just the Timu version called Tina. <laughs> <laughs> Best tiny Tina. So after tiny Tina. <laughs> after I hear from Arya, uh, I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna message the group. <laughs> Be like, I have an idea. You just hold a finger up to <laughs> vague yeah, and like yeah, let your yeah, yeah, just, on. You just get a text from Gorn, let me cook. No, 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 it's the... It's, it's, the I'm, using, I'm using the message cantrip, so... Like, oh, I see, okay. Visibly, you hear in your head from Gorn, I have an cook. idea. And I will walk up to Fate, or what I believe is Fate, or... Whenever, whatever this individual is at this point. I'm gonna put my weapon away. And I'm gonna say, um, I'm gonna activate my gauntlet into shield for him. And I'm gonna tell him, if you can pick this up, we will stop pursuing. But if you can't, we win. He cocks his head. Looks down at the shield. If I can pick up the shield. I'm sorry. If I can pick up the shield. Mm-hmm. I'm not at him. He holds his hands outward to hold the shield. Uh, I'm going to uh, undo the the like buckle and the strap that holds it onto my arm, and then uh, I'll kneel down, set the shield on the ground, and be like, "Remember, no magic. You got, you have to lift it on your own merit." And then I'll, I will place the shield down. Uh, you see he gently floats now, down, as, lands on his feet. Now, as a reminder, Ava. Yep. They have this funny little passive called Mjolnir Shield that says no other creature is able to lift my shield. Yep. So, you see, he extends a hand outward and says, you know what? This feels unofficial. Let's shake on it. Okay. Takes your hand. I don't know if this is the best time to make over it. Gives it a good shake. And... I don't think this is the best time to cook for it. Crouches to lift the shield. <clears throat> One moment, let me stretch. You see, you just start to limber up. Stereotypical. Makes sense, makes sense. Like, torso twist stretch. He starts doing some squats and. You see the fog that envelops him begin to take shape. He squats. 
He places his turtle hands around the shield. He adjusts his neck. The black fog completely wraps around his body. Now, I don't expect you to hold up or end of the deal. This isn't magic per se, but it certainly wasn't fair. Stands up. Puts the shield around his wrist. How do I look? And looking back at you is a jet black version of you. You look like a cheater. Oh, I don't know if I would say that. I would. Um, and I'll, uh, use the other part of that ability, which is to summon my shield back to my hand. He gets pulled to you. You can still get in your free hits. Uh, I'll just turn around and, like, shrug at everybody else and be like, yeah, it was worth a try. And then I'll, uh, I think I'll, I'll back up a few paces and just, like, look at Trayel and, like, gesture at the individual. My you turn. see the, the fog kind of loosens back. He snaps back to his original form. But feel free to take a shot at a mid-transformation if you want. Um, let's see. Let me check something. Shoot him in his mistake. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay. Eat him, me, me. How, how, yeah. clo how close are we? You're about 30 feet out. Uh, me from Trail, I mean. Oh, you from Trail? Uh, Y'all yeah. are still, like, oh. relatively close to being in the circle, aside from those who went up to melee. <laughs> Mimi, it's I'm, time I'm for the look, I'm gonna look to, I'm gonna look to Trail. I know what to do. <laughs> it's time for the uh, bullet strut. Mid raising do you trust me? <laughs> All right, go for it. I'm I'm gonna grab Trail's hand and I'm gonna turn into a bullet. <laughs> it's uh... <laughs> oh god! For what in the <laughs> frame in this the in session two? <laughs> <laughs> I figured this day would come. I didn't this anticipate it to be cooking. so soon. Oh, you're not ready. You're not ready. There's more. Oh. You've been cooking for so long. I, I just... I'm just looking at this Mimi bullet in my hand. Just... Uh, oh, right. this is certainly strange. Fucking open my lever action. Take out the one that's in there. Load in the Mimi bullet. For reference, you know those bullet... Uh, those bullet mobs in Mario with like the the faces on them. The bullet bill. Yeah, I imagine. I look bullet like that, but bill. pink. Or no, wait, blue. Yeah, blue. Slimy me's pink. I'm blue. Oh no. Blue lit bill. You're Unbelievable. Canceled. What what in the Who Frame Roger Rabbit is this? And uh, I'm going to uh, use my deadly aim ability. Okay. Which gives me advantage on both damage and the attack roll. D go away, Steam. I need to roll my dice. <laughs> Never. Get those Steam notifications that pop up right over the, <laughs> the text box. But ever right. space. <laughs> Have you played Elden Ring today? Come on. All right. So 25. That'll hit. And then... Normally, my, my lever action damage is 2d10 plus 1, but I'm not sure what Mimi does, so I'll just roll normal damage. And for damage, it shall be 15. Alright, so Mimi, uh, 
Are you letting impact happen? Are you doing something beforehand? What's the what's the play here? Okay, so you remember when I rolled that nat 20 at the beginning of the session? <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> I'm going oh, I'm going to really bullet bill and <laughs> I'm for, gonna try man get to Max for, for as record, I get shot. The, the giant bullet bills are called bonsai bills. Oh yes, I'm going to bonsai bill after I get shot. She does get a gigantamax, she rolled a twenty. You're going with a gun, that's Certainly a unique approach, that is big. Wait, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> and... <laughs> Let's I, see. So, what, what, I didn't understand what that said. Uh, it was uh, a gun. What a unique approach. Whoa, that's big. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's big. <laughs> so... Wait, time up. Crashes into him. Hold on, let me let me look this up real quick. I don't know if I should crash into him or if I should eat him. Yeah, just. <laughs> I don't know if you want that thing going into your stomach. Yeah, true. Uh, it probably causes some serious indigestion. <laughs> yeah, you've had problems with things you've eaten before. This is probably like the height of that. I would not. True, true. Okay, yeah, I'll just crash into him. Okay, so um. Let's see. I just want to make sure I'm... You know what? I'll roll damage for you. <laughs> if there was ever a time to break the sword, Mimi, it'd be now. think that's fine and then let's tweak that to this okay that should be good let's see what this looks like okay <laughs> so a lot of low numbers damn the yeah. impact of this that's a, that's on the low side that's on the very low side I... There's. I think like there's a good spread there. It's above average. Um. Wow. Okay. So. You. He he holds true to his word. He stands there. And gets shot. And your bonsai bill. The moment you transform to an object that size in the air, going at that velocity, there's a very loud boom. <laughs> <laughs> Was this the same guy that we fought the last time I got to Gigantamax? I don't think so. Or no, run away was, from? That was, that was no, that was movie. Alistair. Oh. Okay. Yeah. I was about to say, it's, a... it's funny, every time this guy comes around, I get to Gigantamax, but no, it's a different guy. <laughs> Last time was a boat. Yeah. Uh, you hit him with this, and he is prone. Uh, is there anything no, else you'd like to do? To you, still may, you still hit him. Is there anything that you're trying to do before you, like, bowl him over and continue, or...? He's prone. Hit him. I mean, technically... Technically, I haven't even done my attack yet, so... Yeah, exactly. True. <laughs> and I... from the other room is saying, pull his dick and twist it. <laughs> pull his dick and I twist am it. going to... That's wild, actually. 
<laughs> You're going to? Yo! <laughs> no! I'm going I'm to... Uh... What is it? I think I have to... I think... Do I have to bite to hold first? Or can I hold? And then I chew. You should turn into Beeman. I think... You... Hold and then chew. Oh, you know what I realized now? Okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm gonna... I I'm gonna... The bullet got inside of him and then hold. Gigantamax and just blown him up from the inside. True, true. I thought it was gonna be more more epic doing this though. That's fair. It, it for sure like Jesus Christ, you I mean thirty D6 is is nothing to sneeze at. No. Let's see. That is somewhat close to the damage of Meteor Swarm. Turn into a giant stone block and crush his bits like Kirby's downward smash attack. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I, ha I have been um, uh, potentially consuming harder materials for a similar reason. What? <laughs> <laughs> Joke's on you, bitch. She ate dragon glass. Oh, God. <laughs> Listen, the more I get accustomed to certain materials, the more I can turn into it. So, I mean, good temporary armor, I, I can be fast and... I have good defense. This is why Kirby's a god. <laughs> He's been yeah. microdosing dragon glass, bitch. You're not ready for her. Microdosing dragon glass is crazy, actually. <laughs> I love okay. that band. So I'm gonna hold. Okay. I don't think you do. Or. Do I bite or hold first? Because it says mouth mod to hit with advantage. Um. Let's so see. I don't see why my hold would. Uh... I don't know why my hold would automatically have an advantage. Does that make sense? Mhm. Mm because I want to. I want to consume. I want to consume. Okay. How do? How do I get to consuming? I want to use whatever that is to get to consuming. Oh, okay. So hold happens, but you just have a lower modifier for it to break. So like basically, uh, you using hold sets like the role they have to beat to escape. Okay. Well, how do I use consume? Uh, I think I have to like bite first, right? No. So it uh, wouldn't be hold. Uh, held bite? target. Yeah, held. It. They need to be held for it to happen. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. So you have him. You. You. You have. You ran him over. You ate him. Okay. Uh. Are you like? anaconda wrapping like eating his entire body in one go or like what are you going for here yes <laughs> we uh whenever i gigantamaxed i assume i took in the eames with me yep to, to help with that yeah you uh, do so so we all became I already Bonsai. forgot his name. Bonsai Bill, yes, thank you. And so we're all right here now. And we just kind of look at each other as much as we can, you know, being one entity at the time. Um, and we're like, okay, here's just, now we know exactly what to do next. And we just kind of like smack down right on him and like a pancake. And just kind of like <laughs> absorb him. Jump yeah. in. Okay. By their Please mouths Jordan. combined. By their so, mouths combined, he will be consumed. Uh, enveloped in slime, uh, he is laying there and... Whenever we're combined, 
Do we have like one set of teeth? You got, you got do the we, advantage. Do we each have, have a set of teeth? Are we like a shark? Uh, uh. <laughs> Would we have yeah, like I'll four for, sets of teeth? I'll say, I'll say for each Mimi, uh, each Mimi layered on another Mimi is another row of teeth. Okay, so I have four layers of teeth then. I thought it was three. Uh, me, no, Emi, me Honey, me, and then I have, yeah, I have, I have my teeth implants. So remember my dragon teeth? Oh mm -hmm. Christ! <laughs> <laughs> That's disgusting. Okay, sorry, not here to judge. <laughs> uh. Man, magic, magical girl, four rows of teeth would be the the magical girl vor campaign. That is wild, actually. <laughs> she's actually, no, she, she really is an elder core. You don't understand. Yeah. <laughs> so. So yes, I am. I am going to consume him. Okay. Uh, crumb. You've just witnessed some crazy shit go down. Uh, consuming something is a multi-turn effort. Mm -hmm. So, uh, what you the, just is, witnessed uh, in sequence. What changes between a normal consume and a um, try me consume? He is also prone. Uh, I will say that because our, our normal cons or this consume is written only for whenever I myself am trying to consume someone, so I wonder what will happen when there's extra uh, force in there. Double time. Let's see. So Technically triple time. Okay. I need you to make one quick modifier to your character sheet. Okay. At the end of Chew, it says... 1d10 plus bite mod pierce damage. I need you to add in per row of teeth. Wait, wait, where? Chew? Yeah, the end of chew. There 1D is 1d10 plus dex plus, plus proficiency? Mod. Yeah. Yep, plus dex plus proficiency. Uh, piercing damage. Per row. Per row of teeth. So every, every, every row of teeth is an extra d10. Oh, I see. Plus dex, okay. plus proficiency. And then... Uh... Ima imagine you critting these two rolls. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> and then I'll say for a try Mimi consume, uh, their death saves are harder. Or air quotes, death save to escape. Uh, and let's see. The larger the target, the more failed rolls needed to consume them. Uh, let's say that... Whenever it's, you're, like, fully stacked up with your memes, mm -hmm. uh, it's just, like, if they fail a roll, you consume them. They fail any roll? If they fail one escape roll as opposed to three. Oh, okay. So, Crump, in sequence, you see... Aria, run in, land a couple of solid hits, you're like, ooh, oh, and then she's flung nearly off the floor, like off of, into the void, seemingly. Uh, you I'll see... Fly. I'll be fine. You see uh, Gorin trying to strike a deal, and uh, fate itself circumventing that deal. Uh Via transformation, I should say. Yeah, they cheated. Yeah, he's he's a filthy cheater. Um. 
Screw after fate. that. We're down for luck. <laughs> after that, uh, Trail did a little hybrid attack with Mimi, where uh, you saw Mimi transform into a bullet, go into the gun, get fired out of said gun, turn into a massive bullet, and then turn into a pile of slime on top of this guy. Didn't you, don't you miss us? Okay. I think as soon as Crumb saw Arya get almost flung off, flung off the the box, she took her starry form. Okay. So if, if you refresh your D and D, roll twenty, she's there in her starry form. Um, oh shoot! Let me do that. Oh my and god! She oh, that's cool as hell. Is going to watch what's happening, and she's just in her head like, "What? Who the fuck is this? Like, who is this?" And she says out loud, "She's like, I think it's time to see what we're actually dealing with here." And I'm going to have Crumb cast Moonbeam on the shadow being here, which, um, let's see. A silvery beam of pale light shines down in a five foot radius, 40 foot high cylinder centered on a point within range. Um, has to make a constitution saving throw. Okay. Um. It gets an if, 11. Well, that fails. Okay. Um, I will say if it is a shape changer... Uh, and fails, it instantly reverts to its original form and can't assume a different form until it leaves the spell's light and it's going to take uh, some radiant damage. Okay. So I'm going to roll for that. That's just going to hurt it. Oh, actually, that's 4d10, not 3. Hell yeah. 22. That's going to deal some pretty crazy damage here. Um, And it's going to... Yeah. Kind of linger on him. So yeah. 4d10 radiant damage. And if it is a shape changer, it reverts to its original form. Is that a, does that occur for every shape changer within its radius? Yes. Yeah, well, every I, was, uh, I think there would be that. separate. I think there would be separate. Well, that's on a failed save, right? So depends on save it changes. Back. On a f uh, yes, on a fail. No one to make that Give save. Me a con me. save, Mimi. Oh, what save? Constitution saving throw. I forgot oh, I you think were I'm there. Good at that. I'm sorry. Yeah, Mimi's oh, Mimi's. No. Currently consuming him. You you just saw me like eat him and like get shot to him. <laughs> oh, I'm yeah. not good at con. Oh, oh you're cool. great. You do not fail. You're good. Okay. It's kind you're of refracting good. in a way where all of a sudden the slime pile on top of him is just now slowing the slime glowing with this moonlight. And it's, it's, a, it's oh, as whoa, if whoa, it's whoa. like soaking it's as if the light itself is soaking into his skin uh you see it begin to burn away and you see this just random guard underneath and it's just like ah! Ah! i knew he was a bitch go see Man, this isn't fate. What the heck? Go see. I will consume fate one day. 
and you see that he's just like looking around frantically and he's just like where stop how is he talking don't stop you just hear like blurbling beneath the slime he's just going <laughs> it, it sounds like someone putting a straw into like <laughs> slime and blowing bubbles <laughs> What what kind of guard? This like, looks to be just a Somnian guard. Ah, uh, okay. That's what I was wondering. It's him, guys, please. So we don't recognize him at all? Nope. Oh. When, you, when you say Somnian guard, like... What is uh, that The city mean? itself. A guard like, employed like, by the, the city guilds. itself. Yeah. Yep. He's got a wife and kids, guys. Hmm. Don't kill Jim. Is Somnia uh, where we needed to go? Somnia is where we live. Oh, okay. Is, yeah, you guys are part of the uh, Central Somnian Somnia. Adventurers Guild. Oh. The Somnian Guard is employed by the Somnian Guild. Oh, okay. So he's part of our guild. Yep. Yes. Or at least but a we... guard of it. He's employed by it. We don't recognize him. Seemingly no, like just. I mean, you see a lot of faces throughout the day. Uh, this one does not seem that important to you. I mean, sacrifices got to be made somewhere. Yeah, that's all Crumb has for her action. Don't be doing that yawning stuff now. Sorry, I'm an old lady. <laughs> I'm an old lady. It's ten fourteen. Uh, I'm a baby. Yeah, he's just now like wriggling in the slime, like trying his best to get out. Hmm. You keep him there, Mimi. You keep him in that beam. You keep him there. Uh, you see, he seems like hysterical right now. Like he is just kind of like writhing, trying to like climb to the surface. Uh, I mean, he's starting to choke on slime. Maze, is he telling the truth? Not kill this random man, you know, at this point. Maze, is he telling the truth? <laughs> am I You're about going. to... Am I about to eat a, an innocent person? It wouldn't be the first time. Great question. Uh... Is he about, is he about to die for the cause? My insight is only a plus three, my guy. Same. Yes, so don't roll insight. Uh, I'll add my six to that just in case. Okay. We got a twenty four. Get 24 insight on whether or not I think fate is just a random shooter guard. Quote unquote fate. Notably, it didn't look like. Okay, so I'll also give this bit of information to Crumb. You remember what a creature burning out, like shifting back to their original form looks like as the moonlight enveloped fate it seemed to just kind of like burn away an exterior it certainly broke an illusion but it was a very convincing illusion this guy 
Remember this man's fate. face. As far as you can tell, just based on the way he is frantically writhing to escape, uh, the way that he is blissfully unaware, like, not even blissfully, uh, panicked and unaware of where he is. Uh, he was possessed. By a demon. Uh, seemingly not fate, but that doesn't mean there wasn't cahoots. Remember this man's face. He must die when we wake up. Unco uncover his face, Mimi, and just keep him there. <laughs> I'm don't going. Let him go. Keep him there. Let him breathe, but don't let, don't just keep him there. Honestly, kill him. Mimi, this man's life We're is down. in your hands. We're down oh. one spot. We're down one spy in the guild. Oh no! Oh no! It's all to me, and I'm really bad at deciding. Uh, I'm going to kill him. Um, if, only, if only Maze were here to give you more information. If only. Uh, he would. Uh, uh, okay, I'm Wait, gonna. What information? Oh, let's go. Kill him. I heard the the whole inside roll, but I mean, do you want me to uh, roll? She was asking uh, for your insight as to like whether this guy seems tied to fate or not. Oh, sorry, check I, this got, guy uh, maze. I got a phone call right as uh, that there was starting. So, yeah. Vibe right. check him before I kill him. I'm oh, check. Do it. Mimi's having uh, second thoughts about killing an innocent. Um, would, this, would this be the first insight, time? Just straight insight. And as far as I can uh, tell, he's just a guard, right? Yeah, he's working, he's just a guard. but he's working with fate. We already cool. know he got spies. Though I do have Dragon Eye, if that gives me anything extra. Uh, you also have that, uh... The... What was it called? Like, the... Astrolabe thing. The Astrolabe. Astrolabe. That's, it. That's true. I, I'll check that. I, I'll check on that. Do an Astrolabe. There's a deep red aura here. Someone uh, willing to get blood on their hands, but seemingly without knowing exactly what they're fighting for. They're just kind of... What you can glean from this, and uh, Gorn, what I'll give you for... You said you are adding your six? Mm -hmm. He's in his guard's attire, one side of his body uh, has an out of place bag of coins. It was S. So he's probably just. He's a not innocent. Bug. Fuck this guy. So he's. So so regardless of anything, he's not innocent. He's just a merc pretending to be a guard. Or at the very least, he was paid off, bribed, or something. Mm. Do it. All right. I'll tell you anything. Please. You don't need to tell me. No. No. <laughs> I can I'm, learn. I'm going to do the worst thing that I think I can do to someone. Oh, no. I'm going to consume all of his memories. Oh, oh fuck. Oh, no. He's a fucking Dementor. <laughs> so, gosh, he's uh, worse. <laughs> Mimi is worse than a Dementor. <laughs> Mimi is an Eldritch Horror. Uh, <laughs> fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> At least now That's he has the chance to become a good person. <laughs> I'm gonna. So I'm gonna if I consume I'm memories, gonna factory reset this. I'm gonna factory reset this man. If if I if I consume his tragic backstory, he can be a good guy. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay. It's like Persona, Persona only really, only messed, really messed up. Messed up. <laughs> All right. So here's what I will allow i will allow you to consume all of his memories you will be experiencing everything 
from the first person perspective. That's fair. That's fair. I was expecting that ba you based will on feel everything he feels. I I was expecting that ba based based on the whole dad sick situation. Okay. I'm down for it. So I know the consequences. Here we go. You're gonna, you're gonna deal with a lifetime of trauma. <laughs> Your story begins. In the syndicates, you were seemingly born into it. Uh, your parents were mercs. Uh, were serving alongside Amir in the Great Crusade against the guild back when that was initially taking place. Uh, you eventually grow up to be a member of the syndicates yourself, a mercenary for hire. Uh, business begins to dwindle with the presence of the guilds and all the regulation that comes with them. Uh, essentially guaranteed results, whereas with the syndicates, it was a, uh, we'll give it our best shot and try to keep it quiet. Uh, eventually, things begin to change in the syndicates. Uh, you witness the remodeling of a city by seemingly people from across the land bridge, which is bizarre. Uh, seemingly with no resistance whatsoever from the people around you. You begin to notice people's like personalities begin to change a little bit. They become more enamored with the changes that are happening. And eventually you find yourself getting wrapped up into it. Uh, you begin helping with construction uh, and eventually you are enlisted by Reverend Thorn, him Thorn himself for a journey to Somnia to acquire more information. Uh, what they can prepare for in terms of combat against these uh, new people collecting all the dragon stones. So, uh, if you accept the journey, you are accepted amongst the ranks of some of the highest ranking assassins within the order. And with that uh, comes the one of the pivotal moments of pain uh, in your life, aside from the uh, loss of your parents at like a teenage ish kind of age uh, syndicate work is really dangerous you are brought back into the uh, you're brought back into a pseudo barracks where they're beginning to build an army and you are branded a member of them uh, a eye above your or at the uh, kind of point where your hand meets your arm uh, and they pull away the brand and the orange glow begins to linger as opposed to kind of fading into a scar uh, and then it eventually just kind of fades into a tattoo you're sent on your way and uh, you are told that you must one uh, plant various totems around the guild in order to properly establish a dream world and two uh, that you must take on some of the strongest members of the guild in order to get information from them uh, the original task was to fight the guild master's private guard but seeing everyone emerge from Mavic's office they assumed that you were the wrong people so Instead of fighting the Guildmaster's private guard, they fought you. Uh, he was given the ability to uh, briefly touch the power of fate in order to last long enough to take a couple of hits to learn That's been the way, yeah. about how you're fighting. Uh, however, he has now voided that information. And now he is here. Uh, a few gold richer and a couple of memories poorer. Almost drowning in slime. Wait, did you take all of his memories or just just like... I took all of them. Oh boy. You factory... to remember his <laughs> she factory reset this man, yeah. <laughs> you now know some incredible restaurants in the Syndicate City. <laughs> he knows that. he knows I, I left like basic things like how to talk, how, how to like, you I know, mean, like, human you might functions as well kill and stuff. Now. Like, he knows how to function as a person, but 
he doesn't really know himself now. He doesn't have a backstory anymore. I took his backstory. Yeah, at this point, you might as well kill him, honestly. <laughs> no, that would be too merciful. And then Mimi kind of, do, do you eventually just return to your form or? We, we give him to Jenkins. We have a new, we have a new housemate. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're going to, after we do that. Enlist him. We're, yeah. we're going to turn back to the Eames. Okay. Uh, he's just kind of laying there looking up. Uh, I, I'm gonna offer a hand to him and be like, I? you need honestly, a hand this up? Might have been, honestly, this might have where been worse I? than fighting the private guard. <laughs> where am I? Hey, you look like you fell. You can, can, I, you doing, can I help you up? <laughs> <laughs> I, I want you to think that Arya and May say that at the same time with two different names. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, Jim? Everybody's like, how you what doing, James? Hey, you. You're finally awake. <laughs> yeah. Uh, hi. Whoa. Turtle man. You were trying to cross the border. <laughs> Why do I know turtle? Portal. Don't be racist. Who? Sorry. My bad. I think. Uh. You you took a pretty a pretty big hit. Are you okay? Do you, yeah. You were you remember right? You came here with us. Are we were checking something we out for the guild. Are we just in an abyss guild? Yeah. 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 Hang on. Hang on. One one yeah. second. Just. Jank Jankles will fill you given, in. Given everything that's that's happened, I want to pull out uh, X flashlight real quick and just kind of shine into the abyss, the direction where this guy just was. Just in case. Nothing. No, no dragons. Dragons? Were uh, there dragons here? Not no, this I'm, time. As I'm, I'm asking that, uh, like, Corin doesn't see any dragons no. as he's no. shining mm. around. Okay. Mm. Question is, how are we going to get out of here? And I will even give a uh, maze. You do not feel any kind of presence anymore, even though it kind of flashed in, flashed out. Uh, you don't feel any kind of... Well, We're all clear as far as I can tell. I, all you need to know is your name uh, is Jim, and Jenkins will fill you in on the rest. Yeah, just Jenkins. Put, put my axe back away. Make a mental note. Like, well, I guess we'll think about that later. And Jim from uh, Pepperidge Farms. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Your name is Jake from State Farm. State Farm. Um, yeah, the, you know the, the farm upstate. Farm. Yeah. How do we get out of here? The State Farm. Who do you mean to go watch? Uh, what? Too, too, it's, too soon, Crumb. Too soon. Oh, it, it's okay. We'll we'll show sleep. you the way back. <laughs> okay. Um, I think that's the way to get out. Right. I, I just kind of, I just kind of lean over. I just kind of lean over to 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 Crumb. I was like, should I knock him out or like? Mesh. Uh, you see, as you guys kind of begin to lay down, uh, he kind of looks up, and his wrist is glowing, and it's kind of glowing. Well, what color? Out. Uh, it's glowing orange. Hand. So he can looks, I he looks get up, anything? He just kind of like looks at his wrist. Um, Maybe eat the hand. I think everyone in the kind of void here is going to hear this. Uh, have we collected enough data? I think so. Should do nicely. And they're gone. These these bitches. I didn't hit him. I I mean I also did not hit him. <laughs> I only I only hit him with my old kit. And they think we're the we're the fucking private guard. Private guard. 
Uh, oh, yeah, and, then, and I didn't hit fucking. You, you, you I didn't, didn't hit any of your my shit. abilities. I just shot Mimi. <laughs> They think so, they know Mimi. They no one all knows they, all Mimi. They, all they really got was Mimi eating him and uh, and a moon beam. They didn't know. Uh, they didn't learn shit. Yep. So, uh, you rolled the you you kicked him. I punched him. I kicked him. Just now? No, no, no earlier. Oh, okay. You I'm gonna kick now? a poor yeah, defenseless no, man? Now. What the heck? At least let him have yeah, a good just, backstory. Just, just, just one, just one swift to the jaw, shake his brain, knock him out real quick. No, he might remember. <laughs> no. Uh, uh, roll damage real quick. No, he won't remember. Don't kill him. Can't remember what's not in there. Uh, oh shit! Yeah, that's my old stuff. Fuck. <laughs> Where am I? Shit! Give me a second. Take it back. Oh, for sure. Just uh, can, can can I can I unheat? Uh, just just roll it. We'll vibe it. Yeah, let's see what happens. Let's go. Okay, go ahead and un unheated, unheated punch. I gotta say, because I'm, I'm I'm not trying to I'm not trying to full sauce. Oh, you said to the jaw? Yeah. Um... He's unexpecting of this. Uh, you don't need to roll to hit. It's gonna hit him in the jaw. And, uh... You feel a snap. Oh, why? Why? What did I do? Uh, his jaw is hanging <laughs> loose. What did I do? Bro? Uh. What did I do? <sighs> you see what you did? What what the heck, Arya? Why do people you usually have it? I don't think he'd be such a bitch. Most people take it and it shakes. He just fucking stat. Can I? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Can I give him a potion? Sure. Hope they'll pull one from the depths. Uh, is he still being restrained? Uh, he's nope. currently, like, rolling around on the ground, like, trying to reset his jaw. No, but, I, let, I let him go a little while ago. I, 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 I kinda grab his hand, like, grab, grab his head, like, put him, like, okay, hold like this, drink, <laughs> no, drink. Yeah, I'll just, I'll gently get him to drink the potion and maybe put a little bit externally on the jaw where he got it. Yeah, kinda just, like, back into place, they, they... <laughs> This is this is the guy that they sent. And then uh like, like touched by fate or not. Is he Honestly you think they would have sent better. I'm honestly insulted that they would have sent this after what they thought was Lisa. Hey now, he... hey now. He has no personality right now. <laughs> that, doesn't, Listen. that doesn't mean anything. Listen. Uh do you guys eventually let him go after like giving him the potion? I was gonna say, is he is he good? You yeah, give, give, him, give him the potion, or... reset his job, but, like there you go. Is he good? He's not I leaving. Gotta get out of here! And he stands up, runs towards the edge, and leaps. He's not leaving. Well... <laughs> are you guys, you guys, are you guys stop him? I I would like to stop him. Okay. I don't know how I'm gonna stop him. <laughs> Persuasion. What? When he tries to run, I'm like, I already hit you once. Yeah, I'll, I'm gonna, I'm gonna persuade. Him. Well, I, cause like I was like cradling him with the potion, so like, all can I just like? Yeah, we kind of, we technically to, had our hands on him, can trying I just, like, to try like, to try to grapple him, him up as he tries to bolt. <laughs> do, do, do. Um, Get in the way that easy, Jim. Sure, you can try to. Okay. It's okay. It's it's okay. We're gonna get you back home safe. It's okay. I can't sleep. I like I this. don't I don't know what the, the heck is up with Arya. You broke my jaw still. 
Aria, oh, that's his first memory. I should heal it. <gasps> oh. I I create to grapple him so he can't get away. Thank you. So you convince him to stay. Like he initially is gonna make a break for it, and then Gorin just kind of like brings him. No. Away. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna hold him like a baby. Uh, he does like scoot a like furthest point from Arya. It could I, have been I, I'm... ten times worse. This fist could have been on fire, or elect, or could have been charged with electricity. I, I'm fire. also sweet talking him. Yeah, I'm just I'm holding him like a baby right now. Uh, Crumb, you cannot help but watch this exchange and just be like, I, I, Man, I just, I just, I just walk away long? and say, Crumb, heal his jaw. <laughs> Fuck this! I'm, 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 I'm like... upset. Fuck it. Comes like we should cut off the hand. I said that, and y'all and everyone's just saying that's crazy. Cut off the glowy hand. No. The glowy hand. Cut off no. The glowy hand. no. Cut off I the glowy said, hand. I told. I I said get rid of the hand, and Why? everyone looks at me like I'm crazy. Eat the hand. Eat the hand. No. Munch, stop it. Crunch quick. I'm just gonna like like kind of turn him away from crumb like defensively like. <laughs> no. Mm. Munch and crunch the hand. My baby. I'm gonna put some headphones on him. <laughs> Give him some lo-fi. Lo-fi? Give him some no, no, lo-fi lo to, 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 to calm and drown out Cyclist The potion and me with. resetting his jaw should have fully fixed his jaw. He's, he's fine. He's, he's not just... fine. His first memory was getting smacked in the jaw. His, yeah, first, he's... Mem his first memory was being ungooed. He's traumatized. You've re-traumatized the man right after we did him a favor by taking all of his memories. Good. Ima imagine oh, getting PTSD fuck. immediately upon being born. Good. <laughs> so I'm holding this man. God. He's got headphones on. He's listening to to Mimi Lo-Fi. This is a journey. I did not expect this session to go this way. <laughs> How do we get the fuck out of here? Do you ever expect any session to go anyway? He could have been onto something with the whole jumping off of the platform thing. He I don't. I mean, I'm already, tr I'm already trying, laying down and attempting to go to sleep. But y'all are making too much of a ruckus. Yeah, yeah. He, I try to lay down. He can go to sleep. Trail with lays us. down. He's a crack he's okay. and a. Arr. <laughs> God. Just I'll try to go to sleep, okay? We'll figure Does it out later. Do have anything to put this man to sleep? I got two. <laughs> we tried. Oh yeah, I swear to God. God. Kill him. <laughs> no, he was healed. Shock. He was fully healed. He's fine. Fence trauma. Fain death. <laughs> fully healed. I have that. With his jaw I have that. Are you no, actually going to do his that? Jaw, his jaw. I, am, I am and going. I reset his jaw. He's fully healed. I'm going to insert. Kill him? I'm going no. to insert some melatonin into his brain. How? how okay. Explain <laughs> this to him, please. I, I want to hear it. Yeah. Me too. I don't know how this one gets. Mimi just becomes a syringe. <laughs> Mimi healing powers. I know I mean, what melatonin the, is. I mean, at the very least, we can give him a drink, right? We've got mead, Mimi. True. Get him absolutely fucking shit based. How would someone with no no memories react to being absolutely shit faced? <laughs> Shouldn't they die? Like, they don't have anything to, like, look back on and be happy about. They don't have anything to look back on and be, like, sad or mad about. It's just, like... I guess they just vibe in the moment. I... You know what? I'm... I'm gonna set him down. I'm gonna start playing a lullaby. I'm, I'm gonna, like, put my hands on his temples and, like, Leech melatonin into his temples. <laughs> Reverse osmosis melatonin. Okay. Um. Go to sleep. Go to oh, sleep. 
Okay, uh... Oh, um... <laughs> uh... <laughs> Give me a moment. Let me look at this. <laughs> Go to sleep, <laughs> Mr. Gardman. Right now? <laughs> Is that what's happening? Are you looking up the effects of melatonin to trauma? <laughs> you know what? What if I just sprayed melatonin in an area around me? Go to sleep, all of you. Like a like a melatonin <laughs> cloud. Go. Like a sleep skunk. Yeah. yeah. I don't like that every that every response there was yes. Exactly. <laughs> sleep skunk, time. like a like a melatonin cloud. My brain. It's EP time. I guess it is EP time. Oh, God. You know what? What do we roll for you to do, like, healing stuff? Uh, medicine check? I think it was, like, a medicine check. And that's what it normally is. I think we pinned it. Should I roll medicine? Chat. I'm pretty good at medicine. Let's see... Pretty sure we pinned it in the chat. Oh yeah, you've got you've got mimic. You can make band aids, so you can heal. Yeah, I can I can heal and I can fix it. But I she's assume not, that she's not flesh replication. Well, it's not just flesh replication. I can also do like, like purge poisons. Uh, I can also like fix muscles and tendons and stuff. But that yeah, it, that also opens up the way for me to use other things that I'm I'm familiar with, like. The natural ingredient melatonin that your your body naturally <laughs> produces. I don't like that nature is being trying here, but you know what? Give She's me, trying. Just give me a flat D twenty. Let's see what happens. <laughs> we're dungeoning, we're dragoning. Let's see if we can dungeon and dragon. Just crit it. Pharmacology roll. You know, I'll add my plus six to okay. that. For my my sure. twenty, okay. So it's a fifteen. So what was initially? I'll tell you what was initially going to happen, and then I'll tell you what actually happens. What was initially going to happen with your nine? Uh, he was going to like look at you in a in like a puzzled way, and, like shake his head a little bit, close his eyes, and like. <laughs> he was gonna he was gonna honk you. Uh, he was for sure just gonna like let you believe that this is happening so that he could be left alone for a moment. <laughs> He's just gonna be like, okay. <laughs> uh, with the 15, you actually do it. You actually manage to pull it off. Uh, and everyone else here actually manages to rest a bit easier as well. Uh, I would also like to throw it like I am actually playing music and it does actually have an effect okay in, in, just yeah, in case help. just in case it matters uh, we have 8 temp HP nice that basically fixed his jaw um <laughs> fuck yeah so, the potion fixed his jaw. He well, had a potion, I'm and, I, eight and I reset it. No, I'm saying that eight is he, the equivalent of the damage that was done. Yeah, that was how much damage he took when Arya punched him. I see, I see. So, so he healed, and then... If he has a broken jaw, eight hit points, you know what, then... There, there ain't nothing I can do for this... Frail... This, this frail shot toddler man they sent to fight the fucking royal guard. <laughs> No, they sent him in to get hit by the royal guard. I'm, I, I'm, I'm insulted for my girlfriend. Okay, you, that's. They to be sent fair. this. They sent this to fight my girlfriend. How dare he did take two hundred damage and was still standing there. Like fine. he was, he was still prone, but uh, 
he did take 200 damage in a turn uh, with some Mario-related shenanigans. <laughs> Which, bizarre-ass sentence to say. I'm about to say, I hit two of my eight punches. <laughs> so, Lisa can do so much more than me. You all drift to sleep. And... You wake up in your Somnian beds. Where's the guy? Where's the bitch? <laughs> so, I'm assuming you all, because if you remember correctly, this all just took place in the middle of the dining hall. Mm -hmm. uh, do you all just kind of make your way out there? I suppose, yeah. So, you all go out there, and the dining hall around breakfast is in an uproar. Uh, laughing at seemingly some wild personality that roamed in and saying, I'm serious. There was a void, and, and I went to sleep, and I woke up, and there was a building, and like a lot of lights, and gold, but it was like dark. It was like Lauren, go get really Jim dark. and take him to Jenkins. They killed her. I will once again <laughs> give up like a baby. I, I'll, I'll go. I'll go give Jenkins the rundown. I'll, Make I'll sure this man has him. a good life. We have a new underling. Teach him. Teach him how to be the best he can be. Uh, Give him you're, a good you're already per you're already perfect, Jenkins. If you could turn this man into half of be what you are, then it would so, have been a success. Uh, after His name a, is Jim. After like a couple of minutes of him like ranting and raving, he's like, "I'm serious. There was, there, there was, I, I was, there was Tiamat, and I, I was cloaked, and oh, they beat the shit out of me. They beat the shit out of me bad, but yeah, we were there." There's a big dragon. Uh, uh, I saw that. Stop making no, the fuss, point, Jim. He's still, like, he's still ranting and raving to the crowd of the mess hall. As I'm holding like, like a baby. And and losing his mind. And he's just like, no, d d you don't understand. And he, like he's wriggling to like get down and like scramble to his feet. I went to sleep. You were there. You were there. You were there. Uh huh. I woke up. None of you. Yeah. Not here. Come yeah, on. That's, that's normal for us. I woke up in a no. <clears throat> Come on, Jim. Flashing lights. You're being a lot. How does he remember Gr any of this? Green, green tables. Green, no, not green. Gray tables. There were shadow people. They were pushed off to the side by. Bug man, I just, guards. I just put my hand over his mouth and start dragging him away. I'm like, okay, this is something for this is something for private talk. Let's go, Jim. And like, as you're pushing him out, he just goes, "The white tabaxi, the white tabaxi, and the crystal man. They killed her. They killed her." Can I just? <laughs> I wanna. I want to just take his face in my hands and be like, I believe. Uh, you. And I, I, I'm just covering his mouth. Like, shut the fuck up. Be like, like hey. take him to Mabic's office. Just no, no, no. I like, I just want to like, like try to calm him. Be like, hey, I believe you. It's okay. We're gonna go talk about this. So, uh, as you all are kind of like carting him away, uh, we're actually gonna wrap session up here with a little sequence. Uh, He has no idea what's going on, but he seems to be getting a moment's rest after all this chaos and getting hit in the jaw. <laughs> he barely knows who he, he knows, like, he knows how to exist, but he feels like he hasn't lived. So he goes to sleep and his eyes open to a car
carpet. He's laying on a carpet. My question is, how did he remember anything? Because I took them. He's in new memories. He... Hold on, just making... Okay, good. He awakens in this carpeted room and in the distance, he sees a woman in a dress and a hat flipping tables and bullets being fired. Just one right after the other at her. She's flipping these tables just in time to deflect. She's get the y'all get the hell away from me. And she flips a table. Oh, I'm going to kill people. I'm coming in. With, I'm coming with Kai. Lady Lost in Trouble. One. Here, let me help. And and he places his hands on the ground, and crystals roll across the ground in her general direction. Uh, she jumps to avoid. One catches her leg. Steal my gun. And removing a cloak is a white tabaxi with half the soul of Thaddeus, half the soul of Trael, and a black revolver in hand with an orange stone. He didn't it don't... steal my gun, he stole half my souls. It only seems fitting to give you a proper chance. Any last words? They're gonna kill you. They're gonna kill you and I'm gonna laugh. My luck may have run out without me, you'll never have any. I will take my chances. And that is session. I don't think we're going to get to roll for Swear Day anymore. I don't think we're going to get to roll for Swear Day anymore. How dare you kill Lucky. I'm no, coming for you day. specifically. I'm coming for the DM. I'm gonna be at your no, doorstep tomorrow. Wait, oh. Ava out here trying to nerf Griff. I'm gonna be at your doorstep <laughs> tomorrow, you bitch. Does this mean Griff doesn't have the luck feed anymore? I mean, I'd imagine luck still exists. Out, <laughs> well, Next want me to find out. On it's time, it's time, for, it's time, time for Griff to take to take her rightful spot as the god of luck. I I don't know much about the Bible, but now we must wait <laughs> oh, no! uh, however many days, three days? Was it eleven days for R and Jesus to be reborn? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, let's let's say it's seven days for oh, seven. R and Jesus. <laughs> I I don't I don't know Bible things. It, it's it's a. Uh... For R and Jesus, it's uh, it's at least one session. Uh... Clap if you believe in R and Jesus chat. <laughs> All right, I'm heading out. Talk to you all later. Good night.
Good night, everybody. Bye. Thank y'all for uh, playing today. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. We do the things. Heck yeah. And I have only... I've literally only used half of what I planned, so... Oh, heck. We take up a lot of time. Yeah. I was like, all right, everyone gets one attack, and that was session. <laughs> we only needed one. I was one. just like, all right. I was like, you know right. how long combat takes with us. There's a lot of us, and we all try to do something. Yeah, no, I think we're going to change over to rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> <laughs> And, like, advantage is you get to use both hands. <laughs> as long as I still get to knock people over, I'm good. I'm pretty sure with advantage and rock, paper, scissors, you just kind of win. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you re- Hold oh, on. There's a way. There's a way. There's a way. There's a way. Well, yeah. Um... Good session? Great session. Yeah. It started out pretty good. We got a nat 20 for luck. Heck yeah. <laughs> we got yep. Bonsai Bill. Exactly. I'm happy I'm happy that you got that crit luck. Same. I'm about to say when I am not the, happy that session where all we do is play Fortnite. Wait, not happy the what? I'm not ha I'm happy that you got a crit for luck. I am not happy that Lucky got crit. Yeah. <laughs> It's okay. That that just means a, a job opening is, is up now. Sure. It's time for Mimi to shine. Little did you know, Lucky left the, the new game plus to, to Kai, unfortunately. I don't know if you'll hit the requirements. Uh, that Okay, so not even joking, that was an idea that I had bouncing around. I mean, hey, she'll take it over. What? Let's see what happens to what? actual Lucky and not just Lady Luck. What? Well, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll fucking yeah, throw I, a I tantrum. Expect, sorry, I was I didn't so, realize I was muted that whole time. I was not expect he bro stole my gun and and my soul, right? <laughs> he stole your he he stole your gun and both your souls. But which yeah. was that the Magnum Opus that he stole? No. Yeah. No, it was his version of the Magnum Opus. Remember when Thaddeus was in captivity? Half of his soul was taken oh. and put into a tabaxi body. And yeah. Magnum Opus is a pistol of light. This is a revolver of darkness. Yeah, this is this is a different mm. mag this is the, his version of the Magnum Opus with a fucking dragon stone put inside of it. Yep. <laughs> I can't believe I've been specking into luck this whole time and <laughs> And then you kill the luck god. <laughs> and then I wasn't gonna get the luck. I, I wasn't gonna become the new luck god? What the heck? No, I never said that you weren't becoming the luck god. You All might, you just don't get the new game, game plus. It's going over, like the new game plus restaurant and oh, barcade is going over. Yeah, yeah, that's what, I, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, okay. no, but we're, we're fully we're down for you becoming the, the god of luck. Okay. I, I, wouldn't want, I wouldn't even want to be the god of luck. I'm, I'm, I'm the soul, the, the soul snatcher luck taker. What the heck? Soul snatcher. <laughs> Luck taker. <laughs> I I figured out how to keep the music going and turn off the voice effect on the fly. I'm very happy that I got that together. Hell yeah. Heck yeah. Anyway. Indeed. Have a good night, everyone. Yeah, good night, everyone. Bye bye. Thank bye -bye, you bye -bye, for yeah, thank you for uh coming to the the Griffin show. I think chat enjoyed it. Da, 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 da. <laughs> I think chat enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. Uh, I definitely it. saw some positive, uh, some positive responses to Trail's bit and the accents we were doing. Yeah, don't, don't, yeah. don't worry. Once, once, once y'all get a, a session in the real world, that's where the real shit kicks off. <laughs> that, that's when we do a session in the real world where we just, where our characters are playing Fortnite, and then we just play Fortnite. <laughs> Hey, I got a nat twenty on how I got I got a nat twenty on Fortnite at the beginning of this campaign. So are you fucking insane? Who knows? Maybe there will be a battle royale uh, in the relative near future. But I'm um, waiting for the tournament, Mark. To be seen. Peace out.
Good night. Good night. See. Bye bye. Have a good one. All right, chat. I hope you guys had fun with that. I certainly did. Sorry, it was a little quiet during some of that. I didn't want to uh, interrupt people. Oops, there we go. Get my background music all fixed up and stuff. There we go. D and D night. Heck yeah. Oh wait, gotta save my thingy. Gotta save my sheet. Da, 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 da. It was great. Yeah, you guys finally got to see how unhinged my D and D character is. It was so different from what I'm usually play, but it's fun to watch. Yeah, that's. That's about an average night for how my my character is. Um, but yeah, I hope you had a good time. I think since it's already pretty late, we usually end a little earlier than this. Uh, but since it's a little later, um, later in the day, I'm going to end now. We're almost on 10 hours of streaming. So we're gonna go find someone to raid. And then we'll come back tomorrow around the same time and do it again! Maybe we'll get a finished Spyro, maybe we'll play something else, I'm not sure what. No idea. Just have to see how I'm feeling, see see, see what we're feeling. Now, now that that's done, I must know what is this 400 goal? The Twitch integrated throwing system! You will get to throw things at me again. Yeah, that's, that's, the, that's the tits. Get to throw stuff at me. The the real the real good goal is the set the special secret goal. I I'm going to cry if you guys don't get to the special secret goal. I've been holding on to it for so long. I am. I I I I can't hold it in much longer. It's been so great. I I have it. I've had it set up and everything. I've been so excited to use it. I've almost leaked it a few times. It's It's been like, oh my goodness, I, I need it. I, I need you guys to see the special secret goal. <laughs> but yeah, Chad, I hope you guys had a good time tonight. Let's see, let's see. Oh, Bunny's streaming today, right! Right, 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 I, yeah, yeah, Bunny's streaming. Let's go read the Bunny, she's doing some art. Figured it wasn't the one I'm familiar with. Oh, the the Twitch integrated throwing system? Yeah, you get to throw stuff at me again. I know chat really liked to do that with my 3D model, and we haven't been able to do that since then. So Yeah. Was wondering if you forgot. Forgot? About Bunny? I can never forget about Bunny. Never ever. Never ever ever. Can never forget about the bunny. But yeah, chat, let's go see her. I I had her her stream up and everything. <laughs> I was just like, alright, let's see who to raid. Alright, bunny! I already have her tab up and everything. Yeah, there we go. Yes, there's our raid uh raid message if you want to raid with us. Uh, if you don't have my emotes, feel free to use ones that you do have. And just there are all my socials, thank you! If you want to follow my Twitter, join my Discord, check out my YouTube, Twitch, or Throne. There they all are in chat, the rest are on my card. I'll make sure to reset my bot and stuff tomorrow. That way they work in the YouTube as well. Hopefully we don't have another stutter, or stream stutter, like what happened today, just randomly. Uh, fingers crossed. Yeah, let's go see Bunny! Let's go see Bunny! Thank you for hanging out with me, chat! I had a great time today! Let's finish up some Spyro tomorrow and... I don't know, go from there, I guess? I have no idea. But yeah! Alright, chat, thank you for hanging out! I feel like I'm forgetting something. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Uh... Eh, it'll come to me. It'll come to me. Good night, chat! Good night, good night! Thank you for hanging out with me today! I hope you guys enjoyed the D&D session and the Spyro! Have a good night, chat.